back to session eight of Starfinder. When we last left our adventurers, they had explored the drift rock, made it all the way to the very end into the uh, a grotto. It's a large cave. The doors were shut, so they didn't see it on the, when they were on the outside. Where they found the sunrise maiden. Oh yes. Which was bequeathed to them, and the last will and testament of Morik and Nash. Um, I would expect you guys to come up with a much more clever name than Sunrise Maiden. Rosinante. And original. Oh, come on. <laughs> you, you know, it, that's what we call, um, uh, what is it, drift. When your projects, you know, your, your target moves. Tokyo Drift? No, that's... <laughs> although, <laughs> Tokyo feature Drift creep. is a good name you, for usually a ship. It's feature creep, but anyway. Um, you would enter the grotto. Oh, scope creep? Scope creep. You had found the ship, and you had found two dead bodies with the organs pulled out and laid out. Um, I don't recall that. I believe you, but I don't recall it. You will probably have to sleep. <laughs> I huh? was full exactly. of sleep. What so this is a, a great big right open cavern? Or yes, no, you can see where you all are. Today. But it's finished floors, so it's not quite stony. There's cap there is gravity. It, every, everything leading to that had been finished. You can see on the map, some of the walls are finished, but some are not. Got it. Well, uh, I'm not going to step into the room just yet, but I am looking at the bodies that are flayed. I, I will reread you the description of the grotto. Okie dokie. With its vaulted ceiling and smooth stone floor, this sprawling cavern has the appearance of a primitive shuttle hangar or landing bay. Oh. An impressive impression re reinforced by the presence of a starship taking up the majority of the space. Only the western wall is finished with the ceramic metallic plating found elsewhere in the complex. The remainder of the cavern is hemmed by natural rock walls. Mm. Huge doors stand on the eastern wall of the chamber, which you can't see on the map. Doors easily big enough to accommodate the starship parked in front of them. Of more immediate interest, however... I'm listening. He's reading the write-up. Are the two human bodies splayed on the floor just inside the western doors? Their internal organs spread artfully on the floor around the corpses. Oh, is this something that looks really important in, in the first episode? Mm -hmm. And then by the end of the whole eight-season arc, it actually doesn't play out to anything? <laughs> yeah, the ship. Oh, and... and <laughs> oh, I, was talking about the I have a name, I have a name, I have, I have a name for the ship, Adam. What is it, Mikey? Spaceball, Spaceball 2, The Search for More Money. Yes! <laughs> and that fits with you guys really well. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I want to. I don't want to go into the room yet because something did that to the bodies. But I want to look at the bodies. Does it look like it's? A, I would say you're all kind of in the room a little bit. Is, but is the blood fresh? Um, is it wet? A hundred million years old. I'm gonna do a mysticism check. Is this a ritual that I'm that we're looking at here? Uh, Twenty-one. Jules, did you want to do the same check? Sure. <laughs> Get it out of the way now. Bob rolled twenty-one. It's okay. Jules rolled a one. <laughs> Jules, 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 try not to be so excited when you get asked to roll. I don't want you to. I don't want you to hurt yourself with enthusiasm. Um, it is. It's clear that something took them apart. Whether it was to study them or to understand them, it it might have been art. It's very hard to tell. Does it? Uh, Ghost has been through formal scientific training. Of is it an autopsy? Is it an autopsy or a there dissection? is there is some. It looks like there's probably some interest in how, in, in, in the parts. Huh. But it's interesting, they just left them on the floor. Ghost is going to yeah. press something on his wrist, and uh, he starts to fade out a little bit. You can still see the translucent outline of his body. He's activating his uh, cloaking device. Ooh. Okay. Uh, and now he's going to sneak across the room towards the ship. Okay. I mean, yeah, I was gonna say while he's doing that, um, I was just gonna walk over to the bodies in plain view of everybody, look down at them, and go, "Those do not appear to be blast wounds." I'm gonna keep, keep my foot in the, the door, door and make sure it stays open. open. <laughs> okay. Um, Here's the map. Bob? Thirty-three stealth. Ghost easily makes it to the ship. Nothing. You don't see anything. Thirty-three. Uh, there is a control. Uh, Can we see more of the room? There is no more of the room for me to show you. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, there is a control panel by the door to activate the. Um, I thought you were going to see the, oh, the um, egg, entrance exit doors on the outside. 
the hangar doors. So there's a little control panel there. Um, so we just have to key it in. There's a timer. It's pretty standard. It's, it's you know it's a million years old, but it's still the same thing. Yeah, it's what we're used to. I just say, open the pod bay doors. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna look around. I'm not opening the ship do- doors yet. I'm gonna use perception and check the ceiling, the walls. Like, how did the ship get in here? Like, there's no opening that we see, right? So well, no, the, the hang there's there's, there's, doors. there's there's hanging doors there. Not oh. just these doors. There's large doors off to the other there's side. Like, I find it interesting like that we circled this whole oh. drift rock, shown a spotlight on it. Inspected the entire surface. I had no idea there was a hangar bay here. Except you didn't listen when I said the doors had closed when that ship came in. Okay. And <laughs> it looks like rock on the outside. So oh, it looks okay. Like rock well, we don't oh, that's that. cool. I like this ship. I want to get it. That has nothing to do with the ship. So, uh, the ship. perception the ship. 25. It was willed to us. Perception what? Um, 25 or old to 17. Uh, you, don't, you don't find anything out. out, out other than the ship and the bodies in that little control panel to operate the door. There's some other equipment in here. I shouldn't say it. There's some other control panels that are not powered up, um, similar to what you found in the hallways. I'm taking my azimuth pistol in one hand and the sniper rifle in the other hand. Sniper rifle in the other hand. (laughs) 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 You you set it on your shoulder, and then you hold the other one in your head. Actually, I'm, I'm very proud. The sniper rifle is two feet and a half, and I'm three feet, so I'm actually a little taller than the, the stock of this sniper rifle. Hey guys, look at this gun. It's almost as tall as me. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want to do, Trigger? Mikey? I mean, if we, if we, if we, if we haven't seen... <laughs> what do we find her body? Did we lose Mikey? No, it's just his audio cuts out really badly. If you guys don't ship and see if I can... I'm bored. Josh, I'm going to start to make my way to the ship. Okay. I go over to the bodies and I do a culture check. Okay. They're, they're, they're clearly members of the Creon crew. They still have their oh, uniform oh, shredded. This is fresh. Fresh within days, but not fresh within like hours. Oh, Josh, I take out a can of spray paint and I start changing the name of the ship. <laughs> Botany Bay? <laughs> I'm only kidding. I don't believe you have uh, spray paint in your inventory, so. Did the bodies look like they were. No, that was, not in my, that was not in my inventory. He's using the blood. Use the blood. Did the bodies look like they were cut with an instrument, like a sharp object, or ripped indelicately? Cut. 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 Almost dissected. Hmm. So, precision and intelligence behind the. Breaking up of these creatures. Yes. Um, anybody who has mysticism, give anybody me a check. I'm not going to roll that one. The DC is high. I already rolled mysticism for you. Yep, this is a different one. Oh, I rolled a 19. Okay. Rolled a 19. That's a so one. that's a 26. There's an echo again. Yeah, it's not as bad, though. If you're not so loud, it's not as much of an echo. 17. <laughs> I rolled better than Bob. I uh, I at least see, it's like something scratching, scratching in the back of her head. Like, this reminds her of something she read, but she can't quite place a finger Is on it. Is it my antenna? No. She can't quite place her finger on what it was that she heard something like this. Do I have fingers? Yes. <laughs> Hard operator going without fingers. I can't aid. No. I at least see. She knew it was DC 30. Okay. <laughs> Which I made up in my head. Fair enough. All right, so the ship is there. It is. Um, all you have to do is press the button to open the, the airlock. Uh, I'll check it for traps. I look over at Clara 247. Oh, she's still with Did us? she miraculously get a weapon somehow? Did she? We gave her a weapon. And then I took it away. Azimuth pistol. And then I took it away. Again. She has an azimuth pistol on her right now. I, <laughs> I reach out. I, I, give me what? Give me. Give me. Adam, we have like seven of them. We can keep going through this. I, I just, I just shake my head at all of you. And you already stole the same one back from me twice. Yeah. I mean, at, at this point, I mean, she's like anybody else. She doesn't want to get left here, so she's not going to do anything to shoot us yet. It's okay. Or she could just kill all of us and take the shit. Felroz Fel takes one of the azimuth pistols. It's okay. I'll fix it. And he, and it's clearly now an art of disaster waiting to explode. <laughs> Maybe once, maybe after one shot, maybe after after fifty, and he gives it back to her. It's better now. 
I'll let you keep this one. You keep that one. <laughs> <laughs> I'd feel very safe if you were going to shoot that at me. <laughs> Thank you, little one. <laughs> Well, maybe this is nothing. Maybe these, these last two crew members decided to stab themselves and rip out their intestines and lay themselves up like this as a way of saying goodbye. Thank you for visiting this trip, Rock. And now we can go. That's are, not how it works. Are, are you familiar with seppuku? No. It is an ancient tradition do of I ritual look like suicide. I care? <laughs> it is a Pokemon. Do not listen it's to him. It is a cute little Pokemon. <laughs> Like Charmander? Like Charmander. Nerd. Yes. Nerd. Do you actually know what a Pokemon's name is? Listen, yeah. I know besides, Pikachu. Besides Pikachu? <laughs> Listen, I have seen this before. I once knew a man who stabbed himself in the head five times and then shot himself in the stomach and then threw himself off of the building. It was suicide, of course. So this can happen. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for that very important distinction. Uh, Ghost presses a button and kind of reappears. Uh, the oh, yeah, that's number first. of turns have passed. His then. name is Ghost. I mean, we're used to this. No, sure. But he's in a different place now. He's by the ship. I punch him. <laughs> Guys, we're gonna go right on that ship. Can we go? Can we go? Can we? Can we? Can we? Please? I believe our work here I'm is done. I'm with the goblins. I want to go. Trigger, do you want to check for traps? I can check for traps too, but you are better at these. Yeah, we can. I can. I can check for traps for sure. Um, uh, we can, uh, I mean, I, I doubt we're going to find any, but we Clonard can... walks over there and starts pressing the buttons until the door opens. Say, uh, <laughs> as he walks mm. over the ship and goes, computer. Mm. Computer. <laughs> and, computer. And, no and, nothing and nothing happens. And nothing happens. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> computer. Then, uh, <laughs> then, then, then Trigger walks over and so, he so just opens, the, pushes the, the button. button. He pushes the button to open the door. <laughs> As he makes a reflex save for <laughs> the the door opens, the lights um, turn on. It should have been in a power save mode. Boom, 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 boom. More like zzz, zzz, How long is this? Perfect. Show been here? Seventy years. So you won't know that until you get in and do a little more examination. But I just told you because I forgot. This is not that old. Uh, yeah. I mean, it could just. That's okay. So we um. <laughs> so the pow, pow, power, 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 to the power to the ship. Power to the ship comes on. So I'm gonna. Ghost and I will go in first. Trigger, trigger, do you know how to fly this thing? It's, it, 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 it's a ship. I can fly any ship. Just like can you and guns. Anything. You have a gun you can shoot. It sounds like a very common workhorse of a ship. Yes. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm, 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 I'm gonna to go get, 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 get on the ship and, 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 and see if I can get it going. Oh, so it's like the B-52 of airships? No. <laughs> Well, uh, because B-52s have an expected service life of 100 years. It's a Model T. Oh. Uh, Trigger, be careful. We do not know what is no in here. And the captain said that there was something that could move through the walls. So there is something <coughs> out there that moves through walls. Yeah, but didn't, didn't we already kill that thing, Ghost? That was before we even found the captain. No, that was the captain. That was the, the spirit of the captain. She was killed by something else. Remember. Oh, before we uh, go, we should get Robo Cosell to get good shots of the, the body so that they can be identified. What will the party do? I, I, th I think what we can do is... Um, well, let's get on the ship and, and, and see what we can okay. find out first. I get on the ship and I go to the galley and I look for saran wrap because to try and put the piece back together and hold them in, because we really should try to bring the remains with us. That would be the right thing to do. What are you doing? Fixing a snack for later? <laughs> what is this, leftovers? You put no. it in the fridge? This is, this is just simple respect. What do you expect by wrapping in saran wrap? That is not what you do. <laughs> Sorry, we seem to be fresh out of Could I tell what race these people were? They're humans. If you oh, died out here, not somebody about it, took yeah. all your organs out. Wouldn't you want someone to bring them back for Trigger? No, I would want to re rise as a spectral ghost well, and then on their butts and works. then kill them. Uh, All right. I, I will. Even death doesn't keep you from killing. That is right. <laughs> yes, it I, just makes me better. I'm going to take the opportunity here to move the camera. Yeah. You guys quickly explore the ship. Hey. <laughs> I was role playing, no? 
Yes, yes, yes. But I, I want to. We move. could have gone at this for another hour. Yeah, you yes, could. You, you could have. All right, we're gonna go single file. All right. <laughs> you would have spent forever exploring the ship. Okay. So, uh, I will give you the highlight. And we'll have we'll have plenty of time to explore our ship when we get it back. Mm. Yes. At the top of the screen is clearly the bridge. Well, who's top of the screen? This is a lot bigger than that little piece of crap we flew out on. That top of the screen. Yeah, I know. What the hell? This um, shit feels a lot like something yep. that it's almost it like I feel at peace. Maybe we call this ship Serenity. <laughs> when did you, when did you, serenity. When did you just become Jamaican? <laughs> you feel at peace. Well, Bob, Bob's, Bob's Russian, so I thought maybe I could be Jamaican. Uh, maybe it is piece of sheep. Huh? Piece of sheep. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We're, uh, and then get it. Uh, so at the front there, there you, have, you have the... Uh, the bridge, the pilot station, it's the captain okay, station, <laughs> engineering and science officer station. Those lighter colored two stations. Yeah, yeah, those, Bob, are the gunner stations. This is a gunner station. Yes. And this is a gunner station. Correct. Yes, and what are, are these doors here? Is that what we're looking at? Which, which ones? Like that? I think there's steps in this case. Steps? Okay. Uh, and so this uh, is... Yeah, where is it? Where is it? No, they're separate rooms, it looks like. Okay. Yeah, separate where is rooms. it? Or... Say again, Mike? Where does Lieutenant O'Horus? Uh, as you work, she's got a thing for the captain, and that's me. Trying to figure out how to get it. As you as you work your way back, um, the circle in the middle there, that is the dorsal turret access. The three, uh, the two rows of three to that that side of it, yes, that is the main airlock. On the other side is crew storage. Continuing toward the back, the room with the single bed is the captain's room. Nala, if you wish to have it. The other one, uh, crew quarters with a hatch to the uh, maintenance access, that circular thing in the corner there. Yep. Uh, moving further okay. down the main hallway there. Um, <laughs> those are lavatories. <laughs> those lighter colored ones. On either, on, uh, oh, here. With the sinks? Yep. Okay. Yeah, on the other side, another set of quarters. Uh, you have six escape pods on the side. Yeah, port. On uh, the starboard. Starboard is right. Okay. Yes, starboard is right. You're right. On the port side, yes. you have the hollow, the hollow suite thing. Ooh. The hollow deck? It's not quite a hollow deck, but close. It's a close. simulator. Yeah, it's a simulator. On the uh, podcast I'm listening to, they have 19 days in the drift. What would you do on this ship for 19 days? I know what I would do. I would, I would start a Pathfinder 5e uh, campaign, and we would play Dungeons and Dragons on the ship. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I want to. I know. I know what I would do. I would kill. I would definitely kill Ayalisi by that time. We got the base. Not if I kill Ghost first. I want to be the rogue. All right. So, um, directly behind the escape I want pods, to find the, duct tape. the escape pods and the hollow, hollow suite there are storage areas. Which can also be upgraded. Scroll no, uh, oh. scroll down, Bob. Those, yeah, where the crates are. Mm -hmm. Those can be upgraded to have uh, Technomancer labs or anything like that. Yeah. Um, I don't mind gosh. <laughs> the that room with the, the circles in there, with the oval, that is clearly the crew lounge dining area, and across the hall is the galley. Why are there more beds than there are seats at the table? Because somebody took the seats to their room to be comfortable, or in the storeroom to have the quiet. That is so selfish. I just want to say that it's very <coughs> selfish. Bless you. Oh, like you wouldn't do the same thing. And then you have the main engineering oh, yeah, with the mean, drift core, the power core, and the drift engine, and then that, um, those little circles off to the side over here. Those are your that's your aft airlock, mm. the auxiliary airlock. Mm. So. You guys are welcome to uh, lay claim to, to rooms. There's no medical day. You'll have to upgrade it. You'll have to either get one put in or trade out it. You know, you'll have to put one in. I, th I think what we'll have to do is we'll have to take one of the storage areas, Bob, and make part medical, part lab, part, and then leave one actually for storage. You are smart, Trigger. I would agree with you. Mm. This, way we, we, this, way, this way we have a place to store all the stuff that we steal. Yes. I mean, that we acquire. That Sorry, good. acquire. Can we go to the bridge and uh, activate scanners to so find the creature? 
you can do that. It's been ten minutes. <clears throat> Ghost hasn't killed anything. I'm gonna, yeah. I'm gonna go to the. I, I, I'm gonna before I go anywhere, Josh. I want to go back into main engineering. Yep. And uh, make sure all the systems and everything's operational. Sure. Give me a computer check. Yep. Right. Hang on. Right. Computers. Myself. Just a moment. <clears throat> Uh, 26? Yeah, everything seems, uh, been, uh, yeah, it was cleanly shut down. It's going to take you a few minutes to bring it back up, but everything looks in normal operating order. I assume you're going to initiate the uh, po uh, power up sequence? Yes. All right. I will Hello, start ship. to bring the ship online and bring it uh, up to power. Hello, ship. Hello. Okay, I'll give you guys the option. Okay, you... Is the ship Ford, or do you want Ford to come later? No, not Ford yet. No. <laughs> that voice you used earlier that I what, said you should use name? in game, but I totally forgot what it was. Uh, well, Jules, your father has one voice, and that's it. No, I don't. Yeah. Oh, oh, wait, wait. Maybe, maybe there are personality options. Maybe we like should look Siri. through the, the library there's only one. of options. <laughs> hey, can you make? Can you do? Josh, can you do Ford, but as a with a girl's voice? Ford Mark, was a girl. Mark do you remember? Robert. No, Ford was a boy. It was, it was a preteen. Miguel Bear. It, it, it was a boy who had... I know, but... I can do but a British that... accent. Do you want the computer to be no. British? You, you did that same voice as a ship AI. Yes. In our, our sci-fi campaign. Yeah, I know. And that was a girl's That name. was Sarah. Sarah. Strategically advanced daughter, remember? Yes. Strategically advanced, advanced acronym. Miguel Bear. Greetings, guests. I think um, Ghost and I lay claim to the room across from the cap... Yeah, with being, access being the to the uh, creature, I believe the captain's quarters should be mine. Mike, you uh, no, it's called. Mike, you it don't goes to the captain. The you don't... There's enough beds that Wait, what was that, Josh? You don't want to be in the back, closer to the engines. I wasn't planning on sharing with you anyway. Um, no, yeah. I'm just saying, there's enough room for you to just get rid of one of the other beds. Wait. Yeah, you know what? That's actually a better idea. Maybe Ghost and I will take one of the back ones because because then we're also. Okay. Um, did you guys still have Morgan Nash's data pad? I assume. Yeah. I, think so. yes, yes, we I took yes, that. We do. I see you have obtained Morgan's data pad. I have been programmed. I have been programmed to respond to commands through whomever has control of that. Welcome. Who is the captain? According Nala. Uh, go. I was just going to say, according to, <laughs> according to her will, we found her body and her data pad. Therefore, we are the new owners of this ship. Affirmative. Who is the captain? Captain here. Uh, uh, my here. name is Trent. Okay. <laughs> the, the captain is not. I am the pilot. <laughs> Greetings. I'm here for moral support. Welcome aboard. Nala, look at me. Look at me. I am the captain now. <laughs> okay, you are the captain. <laughs> but I was the captain there for a second. Uh, uh, sure how, you are. How should we uh, call you? What's, what, is your, what is your designation? I am now running the default protocol. I have no designation unless assigned. You can be referred to me as computer. There are numerous other uh, voices and personalities within the data banks that you may choose from. Hmm. Would it be wrong... If we were to find an engineer that we, we, uh, we, we, um, you know where I'm going with this. <laughs> find an engineer we really respect and make our computer module right after that engineer, then fall in love with that computer model, and then go meet the real engineer later. Really? Would that be bad? <laughs> and they come across as really creepy. And yes. Find out that she's married. Is she married? Okay, okay she but was. what's her name? Come on, genius. I don't know. Laura Brahms? Brahms. I was Leah happy. Leah Brahms. Leah I was happy I can come up with the plot, okay? <laughs> anyway. Um, what institute? They, they Daystrom Daystrom Institute. Daystrom Institute. If you would like, I can alternate and try to some, some samples. Or we may continue on this process for now, and you may select them later. This is too fun. We can spend like five days doing this, guys. This is wonderful. But time out here. You would think that the ship would be at the same level as maybe one of the synthetics, one of the androids. Would it have the same... The android has a soul. Ship does, does the ship have one? No. That's weird. It's just a program. What? It's, 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 well, it's... Okay, what's the difference between... 
The ship, the I ship believe it's the, the soul. Sh- the ship isn't designed <laughs> to be that yeah. intelligent. Okay. We can tell Jeff has not had a lot of whiskey yet. He's asking very deep philosophical questions. <laughs> you know, right? It's a good so, uh, fire, I guess. I don't fire? know. Fire? <laughs> really guys, That's right. I'm now, uh, what? Guys, where do we sleep? Right, can we have rooms? Can we stay, please? Yeah, 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 yeah. You can. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Zena. Uh, Is there a break somewhere that we could? <laughs> Josh, once Josh, once I get the ship up, uh, uh, get the engines online, and get all that, I'm gonna head up to the bridge and get myself familiar with the control. Sure. Kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of a bad mix to have your ace pilot also be the engineer, though. <laughs> when those are two completely opposite ends it, of the ship. Triggered. Yeah, I. I... <laughs> of engineering or pilot? Both, but engineering, not bad. Uh, have we activated the scanners yet? The scanners not are available. No, not, no, no, not, not yet, Ghost. I, I, I just had brought the ship online. Computer. Uh, I got to head to the bridge. Yes. Can you please do a full diagnostic on the different systems? Processing. Life support. Uh, uh, Nala, can I, can I have the pad? I need to go bring the rest of the ship online. You don't need the pad for that. You just need the pad to get in. Okay. Life support is fully functional. No, that's good. Power systems are fully functional. Drift drive will come online. It will take 12 more minutes to warm up. Weapon systems are operational. Uh, what is the g- 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 ghost? Go, go check out the go, ghost. Check out the the, the weapon systems and, and make sure you know how to operate them. And then take the big Ufus guy with you and make sure he knows what to do. Hey, I think that's you. I think that's me. Hey, Ufus guy. All systems are operational. Drift drive will be available in seven minutes. It's a fast three minutes. Um, I'm going to bring up, bring up, Josh, I'm going to bring up scanners. If there are scanners on this, I'm assuming there are. Yes. Um, can I scan through any of the, any of the core of the rock? You are unable to scan the rock. The same way you could, your scanners couldn't penetrate the rock, you can't scan outside of the room. Okay, so I can't even scan outside the room either. Even through the doors, it doesn't, it doesn't register anything. Correct. I'm trying to make okay. out this piece of paper. What about in the room? Can you scan anything? In the room. You can scan in the room. And you find that um, the computer is able to... <laughs> the computer is able to interact with the dock doors. So you're able to open the doors from within the ship. Does the computer have um, the computer, okay. uh, monitor logs on the external of the ship that recorded what activity happened outside the ship, including the dissection of the two human crew? No, it was powered down at that point. Hmm. No, there are no logs available for that time. Co- no co- you can ask the computer that. Co- right? Computer... computer. Computer, yes. can you can you bring up any historical logs of the prior crew? The prior the uh, prior to this, only uh, Morica Nash was on board. She docked here. He exited the ship. There was a problem. I have been instructed by her to shut down after a certain amount of time to preserve battery and the fusion core. And I have been in a suspended state since then, approximately seventy of your years. Seventy years. You just sat here for hmm. 70 years? You know nothing of the Vresk attack, or the uh, the Horde, or the other things that have happened? I am not go, 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 ghost, ghost. I think those all happened. Ghost, ghost. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a computer, computer ghost. You can't, you can't reason with the computer. We talked about this. We, we, don't, we don't shoot the computers unless I tell you. Okay. And, and we don't try to reason with the computers. Okay. Okay, Trigger. Trigger, maybe we should change the uh, access level. I do not know if it is good for the space goblins and for uh, the android to have the same level of access as me. You know what I mean? It's like, you know, wizard jail. We do not want them to blow up the ship, activate the self-destruct mechanism. Do you wish to activate the self-destruct mechanism? No! 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 No, No. No, thank you. There, wait, they actually built a self-destruct mechanism? That just seems like the stupidest thing in the world. <laughs> it's actually just a program that overheard the, the, the core. Yes, it seems yeah. stupid to put something and like any, that on the ship. Any monkey or human could write that. Well, neither a monkey nor a human. Any goblin or human could write that. How long did the captain ride on your ship alone in the space? Of the, the, the captain did exploration. She did transport. She did... Did she pick up? Companions along the way for a while, and then yes, some of the sometimes and... she did. She she owned the sh- she owned this ship cool. for many years. 
approximately, oh no, it shouldn't be approximately. She owned this ship for 22.75 years. Does she have any? What, 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 what is your manufacture date? date? Really? Really? 22.7 years ago. <laughs> where, uh, where does she store her personal effects? Where is the gold? Where are the credits? Where are the valuable things on the ship? Don't tell him! No, you can't tell me. Captain, please ask me which, please, which should I do? Uh, you can listen to me. Uh, you are the, ca should I, should I answer either of them? They have, they have, they have asked the conflicting questions. Delay. 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 That's very annoying. Delay. Delay. May I say that is very annoying? Delay. Um, computer, stop that, Delay. please. Computer, where are her personal Delay. effects? The in, in captain's the personal effects are in her chamber. Is there any storage also orders. that there? You'd be, it's weird because if it's... She was actually... she Her normal crew was not on board when this occurred. Their personal effects may still be in their quarters as well. Uh, the, the hatch is close to the ship, yeah? We have closed the hatch? Yes. The hatch is now closed. Should we activate the force fields as well so nothing can get in? She, Perhaps we shield, should just shields leave. Are not, shields shield. cannot be operated inside the dorm, inside of here. There is not enough space. Can you make a small shield? No, the shield is the size of the... It creates a bubble around the vessel. Bubble, okay. Let's, let's take it out. Hmm. Okay. We'll see. After rolling a successful culture check... Are, uh, the ship is unaware are of all the, uh, sorry, sorry, go ahead, Adam. The ship is unaware of the Kasafian world Adari, world ship Adari arrives in Packer World Space. Ooh. It does not know about first contact with the Aslanti Star Empire. Castrovel's Lashuntas and Fordian sign a landmark peace deal, ending a millennia of conflict, and is unaware of the recent swarm attacks on both the Pack Worlds and the Vescarium, and therefore the alliance between the Pact World and the Vescarium. Can you please tell this thing I'm not an enemy? <laughs> <laughs> as, as soon as you leave, are you leaving? Are you flying out? Uh, I'm, yes, I'm we're going to... I'm going to... Is, is, Josh, has it, come, has, has it been seven minutes? Has everything come online? Yes. Can you connect it to your okay. phones? It, it, if, every, if everything's come online, I'm going to see if I can plug my exocortex into the ship. And do what? Just, Just make sure, sure that I am connected, connected to, to it. it. Upload. Can you upload the past seventy years of technology? As, as, soon, as soon as she, as soon as she's clear, though. as soon as she's clear, this she'll get the the information from the space beacon by off the station. She'll update herself. So why why wait? Do it now. Because Mikey can't, can't possibly store all that. He's also. I I, I, I can't store. He, that. I, yeah, he, I, I can't store that much. All he, he's also full. <clears throat> Mikey's full for everything downloaded. Yeah. The, Which he can also. Yeah, I, I have everything, everything from the other ship, ship. Bob. I, I have no. I have no. I, I, had I had to, to get, get rid, rid of other, other stuff, stuff to, to download yeah. that. Uh, Josh, I'm ready, I'm ready to take it out. If we want to open the doors, we can go. Make it so. All right. Captain, Captain, on your command, I'm ready to take the ship out. Let's go. Engage. Ghost goes to the engineering station. All right. And the... All right. I at least he presses the button to open the door. Ooh, the dock doors. The Star Trek team plays. <laughs> the ship slowly panning view of the ship zooming, cru cruising out. As soon as soon as soon as, as, soon as, 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 soon as, as we, we clear, clear, I bring shields, shields up. up. As soon as it clears, um, even as, even before it finishes clearing, Captain, request permission to to contact the space beacon and update my data files. Update files. Thank you. You clear. Is this like Mikey. a Windows update? How long are we talking here? Hours. Seventy years worth of data. Oh boy. Think of the music alone <coughs> and the videos, the movies. Oh my god. I know like every second, like 17 years of big data gets uploaded to YouTube. That was pretty good. Something like that? Yeah, it's insane, right? Wait, what, which one was that, Josh? Which one was that? Johnny Walker? That was a Johnny Walker uh, special edition. Game of Thrones edition. Game of Thrones winter walker. Oh. <laughs> Jeff's daughter is making it her personal, Jeff's stepdaughter is making it her personal goal to watch every video on YouTube that comes up like that. You know, you just said the ad one every 17 seconds. Oh. Jesse is... Well, she's, she's got a goal. Well, no, she's, she's got a goal, Josh. Besides, I mean... She don't have time for YouTube anymore. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so the I ship messed up. <laughs> the ship comes out. Um, I assume your... Shields shield, come up. Shields come up. I assume you're heading back to Absalon Station. 
Uh, yes. Yeah. Do you want to do one more turn of the planet? Of the Drift Rock? I think we got what we came here for. You, you really have all the information you need you, to you satisfy Grubbers okay. Thor. But I'm going to sit in the gunner's seat because we just got a new ship so you know what's going to happen. I will go to the engineering station. <laughs> Are we going to get credit for... Who, who actually has this next highest engineering after me? Probably. What's yours? Goes. <clears throat> my, my engineering is a 12. B B base Mine's 12. Minus. Jeff, Jules? Mine's an 8. Ghost? Uh, 14. 14? <laughs> He's a better engineer than... The, the engineer, so that's okay. Mm. So the, the operator's a better engineer than the mechanic. <laughs> the other ship went back automatically without us. Yes. Mm -hmm. Once it had. How is that even possible? Package. It yeah. autopiloted you there. It was an autopilot you back. <coughs> uh, only because Mike <clears throat> rolled really well on my abilities, so my intelligence is like super high. And as an operative, every couple of levels, all of my skills go up by one. So by the time I'm like oh. 30 operative, it's like plus 14 or something ridiculous to all skills. So right oh now my I, get God. A, okay. I get a baseline plus two to all skills that I've, I've trained in. Okay. <laughs> um, I would say so, the operative is better at anything skill related than the people whose primary skill that is. If we had a mystic, <laughs> the operative would be a better mystic than the mystic. We had a doctor, the opera would be better than the doctor. <laughs> it's just the way the game is written. It's, that's not quite true. My mystic yeah. is not as good as a true mystic. And I'm, I'm only focusing on the stuff that we already don't have skills on. I, I'm commenting on the game system only. <laughs> as, as you guys are starting to fly out, the goblins are occupying Roboco cell. And they actually somehow convince it to follow there into the crew storage, which is across from the main airlock there. At which point, if you wanted to close that door and have a few minutes of privacy at sure. Robo Hotel, you could do that. I feel oh, like I, 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 I push, push the, the button, button on the on the, the console, console and make sure that I closes. I feel as though at this point there's no need. It's been following us for two, three days. Right. Well, now now is the oh now it's locked in. <laughs> now now it is locked in a closet for the moment. Now is the, now is your opportunity to ask Ghost and Trigger <laughs> what the stories of those guys on the planet who you yeah. who they convinced you to attack. So, 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 uh, um, yeah, we also had the goblins, or the, not, um, yeah, the, the, uh, yeah, the only they're locked in the closet only, with the mobile cell, yes. and nice. And actually, <laughs> they're actually they're, they're entertaining it. Yeah. It's actually, oh, it's, two, four, seven. Seven. Yeah. it's actually gonna be a new reality show. <laughs> two goblins in a room. <laughs> two goblins, one Robocop. Yeah. <laughs> two, two, two goblins in a crew story. Two goblins, they find one closet. So, all right. So, if you want to what ask about that problem, that, that, you don't have to tell them. Stuff. You don't have to tell them if you want, but it was kind of implied that you guys would tell at some point last game. Uh, so, besides, so we have a moment. Uh, tell us about the academy. Ghost looks I at. I lost trigger. my voice entirely. I have no idea what happened to that voice. It's gone. Kind of lost mine too. You just you just found it again. Uh, go go go. Let let's just give him in, in the the basics on the academy. We, we, we do we do. Oh 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 them oh them a little a, a little. I mean, we have killed for you. We should know why. It is true. You are good at. I'll try the one, Jeff. The, talent. The first rule of the academy is you do not talk about the academy. Interesting. We are talking about the academy now. If I tell you this, they will want to kill you too. So I normally do not do this, but because you are good at killing, <laughs> I will give you the choice. You do not need to hear this, and you do not need to have the academy after you. Are you planning on telling the Academy that we had this conversation? Oh, they'll figure it out. Oh. The, 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 the Academy knows everything. Some... Is it like a... It's not like you... It's not like you can... The Academy, is, I'm telling you, it's, it's like, you see that star we flew by? The Academy owned... They have a listening station on it. Exactly. You have governments... You have intelligence agencies in the governments, and then you have agencies that oversee the agencies, and then you have the academy, 
which is beyond all of this, and you cannot find them. They have funding beyond everything. They supersede corporations. They supersede the government. They are, they are basically Facebook. That is what they are. <laughs> They are essentially known in, 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 the, in, in the terms of the pro pro professional world, you might know them as Virtucon. Virtucon? Sounds like the Aruba band. Oh, what's that from? I don't remember Virtucon. I don't remember either. You don't know Shaka Khan either? That is his cousin. Shaka Khan, let me love you. No. I'm familiar with Shaka Zulu. Shaka Zulu, that is his cousin's cousin. Isn't that still your cousin? That's from, that, that's from Austin Powers, Adam. Thank you. I couldn't place it, Mikey. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, it's okay, buddy. What, the, um, what does this have to do with YouTube? The, 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 the Academy is amazingly mm, powerful. Um, and, well, Ghost, you, you can tell them more. It's okay. It's they, an academy of what? They recruit you. Do, 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 it's just the... I at least think, 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 think of it as like the, the academy of death. The academy if you keep the, asking, you will be, you will be dead. Oh. They recruit you at a very young age. Usually the average age of recruitment is six or seven, depending on your species. Why didn't I get recruited? It is easy to I don't think you brainwash. Want to be recruited. It is easier to brainwash when you are that young, and the graduation rate is approximately 20%, maybe. They is teach it you- because they die? Do you, do, do you want to know at least what happens to the, to the other 80%? Uh, do I? No. Oh yeah, no, no, you asked, so yes. yes. So you, 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 if you don't make the grade, you just disappear. No, that's scary. They teach you things, you learn skills, you learn a lot. You become like me, you learn lots of things. <laughs> <laughs> they teach you medicine, they teach you life sciences, physics, mathematics, the principles of war design. There's a lot of skills on here. Combat. Uh, Sutterfuge. Did they teach you to kill? Of course they did. <laughs> I knew that on my own. But no, they teach you to kill. Of course they teach you to kill. You knew how to kill at six? Yes. That was one of my first assignments, was to kill an old man. They give you assignments, at first tiny, and then bigger. They send you into the city. The old man was a really small old man. Sometimes it is to collect a piece of information. Sometimes it is to pick up a rock. Sometimes it is to kill an old woman. You do what they say. And then, when it is time to graduate, they take you and another student, and they send you out, and they tell you you are going on mission. But you do not know your graduation mission is to kill the other person. What? And this is what they did for Trigger and myself. You two have orders to kill each other? So who won? <laughs> we both disappeared. <clears throat> No, ghost, 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 did, 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 did the captain of our ship just ask us that question? <laughs> that was a Jeff question. I had to double, check, had to double check my intelligence there for a sec, sorry. That is the account. So, 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 so like Ghost said, our assignment was to kill each other, and that's how one of us would have graduated. But as you can see, neither of us is dead, and... We we formed a pack and managed to uh, escape. Um, but as you can see, they still know we're around. I'm I'm pretty sure Ghost is dead on the inside. Oh, <laughs> that hurts my feelings. You have feelings? I am going to my crew quarters. I am going to cry for fifteen minutes, and then I am coming back out and pretending like nothing happened. I take all the feelings. And I make them in a tiny ball, and then I put it out the airlock. You don't need to put it out the airlock if it's that small of a ball. We can just like put it in a compartment somewhere. You could put it in your cheek pouch. No, you I got think... a point there. All right. I, I, we we'll talk about. I, 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 I think, I think the, I think you people are getting a little off topic. Yeah, we're good what at that. What I think you need to know <laughs> is how long have you been playing with us? That the enemy knows we're not. No. 
and and plan on seeing them again. That's not the last we've seen of the. It sounds as though if we've been seen with you, then we're already targets anyway. Yes, it is true. Well, since we managed to let them get away, the 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 answer is yes. You're already a target. See, the good thing about organization there is no is doubt there is the, 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 there is no doubt that the academy doesn't know who every one of you already and, and you're already probably on a list to be exterminated what about the goblins on the list probably they're on the list too the good news about organizations like the academy is as big and powerful as they are they're still only people i could kill people hmm. it is a lot of people I don't want to kill all of them, just the ones who try to kill me. But you cannot see them. How can you kill what you cannot see? Henry. That is the problem. We saw those guys down on the on the, the surface of the drift rock. Yes. And how well did that work out for us? Not good. Well, we all survived. I think we did we all... quite well. Mm. Oh, another thing about the Academy, when they figure out where you are, they just leave messages on your hotel voicemail saying things like, <laughs> I know your secret. Ha, 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 ha. That was Nick, I mean. And look, he plays, a, he plays a voicemail. I know your secret. <laughs> ha, 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 ha. <laughs> I get this stuff all the time. I don't understand why. You can just block the number. I did block the number. They keep giving me new spam numbers. So, so They're Claire, like Scientologists. <laughs> they are like <laughs> So Clara, who'd been very quietly sitting in the corner, Unobtrusively. What is Clara doing? What is she doing here? How did she get there? <laughs> Where did she get that gun? I would not tell you any of this stuff. Oh. When you want her to not be there, when you want her to not have something, it's so, fine. When I want her to not have something. So who was one. who was Argus then? Because he seemed to have a personal relationship with you. I, coming from I give you a gun. No, I do not give you more information, on robot woman. Seven. Who was this Argus? He seemed he knew you guys uh, intimately, yes? Did, did, uh, I, I did he intimately did is a very... very <laughs> Nala, la, la, where are you going with this intimate? Claire is not even in the room. because She was in with the goblins. She, the, uh, evidently, she's in the room. She was very quiet. I mean, that's her job. Mm -hmm. She's not in it. Yeah. She's just kind of fading. She doesn't have to hold her breath. But now you have raised a question. I have a question for you. What is your story? You tell us your background story now. Does she have blood? You've not answered my question yet. One for one. Well, no, we said you, your life. You seem to think that this is that you have some sort of advantage here. Yeah. Should we put her in the airlock now? She's still bound, right? Yeah. Give me that weapon. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome to it. <laughs> so. We'll put it in the other airlock. <laughs> don't get it mixed up with the other azimuth pistols. I don't think we could look at this. Look at yeah. This. Actually, when you when you look at what it, is this thing sticking <laughs> off on the side? Actually, when you when you look at it, she's actually repaired the, the pistol, but left all the additions on, so it looks bad. Mm. But it works fully normal. Nice. Oh, okay. That's clever. <laughs> so the Democrats really hate this gun, but they have no idea why. <laughs> <laughs> I I am a hired mercenary. I was contracted, and provided a vessel to shoot you down. Obviously, I failed in that regard. I was given half pay for the attempt. I will not do not expect to receive the other half of my pay. How much were you paid? I was. Uh, I had a thousand credits transferred into my account. Two thousand total to kill all of us. Only you. Well, it was to shoot down the ship. It wasn't specifically to target someone. It was to shoot down the ship. Your your ship crashed on the drift rock. Yes, it did. Who put salvage that? That is an expensive yoxian. Funny, funny freight. how we never saw that. When we were inspecting the drift rock carefully, shining a spotlight on it, floating over every inch of it, <laughs> carefully walking across the street, that's be that <laughs> trying not to slip. <laughs> that's because the the, the the academy people destroyed the destroyer. They had a, a device that just completely pulverized it. There was nothing left. Vaporized. Oof. Vaporized. Atomized. Incinerated. Atomized. We'll go with atomized. Disintegrated it. Disintegrated. What did you it. do to it? They used a spell. Sorry. They used a, a powerful spell from the scroll. The catalyst and disintegrated it. Mm. I assume they paid you with the cred stick. Uh, they oh, they were paying me. With, they were paying me with the right off this rock. Uh, but they got, they paid you the one thousand credits. Uh, she said that was a transfer, not a cred stick. Was it a transfer? I have no idea who hired me to, for the original shooting down. No, I want to know if you have the one thousand credits on you. No, that is in my account. It is not accessible from here. How do we? How does one access accounts in this modern age? 
You do not know anything about accounts? Well, tell me. How do you access your accounts? You're, you're a fugitive. Well, I do not use these systems I because I do not trust the system. I carry it all in cred sticks on my person. Mm-hmm. But if you are going to walk into a branch, and they say, hello, how are you? And then you give it a can, scan. Can, can, I, can I make a suggestion? But I am you explaining need... banking. To yes, 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 yes. <laughs> and I'm, I'm going I'm to expand your knowledge of banking. Oh, yes. You need to use the bank of villainy. The bank. They, the bank of villainy. Oh, oh I've heard of the BOV. <laughs> <laughs> they do not require any of that stuff. No? No. What about no, the... No, you just go into the bathroom, and you look into one of the urinals, and then they let you in. Do you know what this is from? This is from the Spickle of A. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if that's the exact term he used, but <laughs> the villainy. So does, is it a retinal scan? A yeah, facial scan? It's a retinal scan. Not retinal. No. Not in that bathroom. It's <laughs> a urinal scan. <laughs> it reminds me. It reminds me of John Wick, where they just pay them in like bars of gold. Yeah. What, what I'm like, trying to get at is what part of her do we need? We need her eyeball. Or her head. Or her head. Yeah. You really just need the retina, I guess. Anyway, there is another problem we have. Robo Cosell has been showing all of our exploits to the entire station. I'm not particularly happy about. This is going to be very popular. There's action, there's romance, there's a dashingly good-looking action hero. Oh, right. Where is Thank their you. romance? Oh, right. We may be able to use this as uh, I, I think it's because he thinks I'm dashingly good-looking. So, you he, don't forget, you you and uh, Ghost and Trigger were disguised by Ilesi. I assume you've managed to maintain that as best you can okay. during the course of this. Mm-hmm. Um, you, uh, by Nala. Nala by Nala, yeah. Ozzy made no effort to camouflage. To I hide. just tried to keep my head down. I don't know how well like, it worked. Yes. <laughs> Vesk, they all and look your the head same. Is eight feet I, I, Yusoki, they all look the same. That's true. <laughs> I, I was actually making my face more available. Like, seeable. When we come back, though, I have to imagine that there will be many Wait, are we going on a commercial break? No, when you get back to the Absalom Station. <laughs> After the break. <laughs> Oh, we're doing that thing we said we didn't want to do. Let us tell you about Fresh Apron. You can have <laughs> things shipped to your house. And also stamps.com, where you can get your own stamps made. Now back to the story. Brought to you by Carl's Jr. <laughs> now back to your regularly scheduled programming. We are going to be well known when we return to the station. This will be a problem. I feel like this is a problem we can deal with when the time arises. It will happen when we return. Cle- clearly, it didn't affect you. Uh, clearly, it's not going to affect you because the Academy already knew where you were. They know where we're going back to. True. We'll have to disappear after we get to the station. Perhaps Chiskix can help us with this. How does a movie star disappear? Elvis did it. Think about Brad Pitt. You already disappear. <laughs> Just disappear again and do it with all of us. But there's less and less cool places to go. Where do I go next? Castro Velva? The dead planet. Castro yeah. What's it called? Cast- there's a Castro Vel. Castro Velva was actually Dr. Who planet. Damn it, you're right. Castro Vel. <coughs> this is actually, a cool place. That is, that is the next stop. Oh, is it? <laughs> cool. <laughs> I knew that hey, spoiler alert. I haven't watched that episode no. yet. <laughs> Keeper of Dragon? Nice. Wait, I'm getting it mixed up. Yeah, you are. You guys hear the door open and the goblins yipping. <laughs> Robo is like, like I'm zooming out. Zzz, what, a, what have we missed? This is like a very important meeting. We were in a battle with a dragon. There was uh, espionage, conspiracy. There were great battles. There was love lost. You missed it all. What Cap- he means to say is, we were having a rock, paper, scissors tournament. Captain, it would appear there were things discussed there that may not, you may not want on the record. Would you like me to delete the logs for the last 12 minutes? Is this the computer talking? Yes. Clara talking? It's the computer. Hmm. I like this computer. Computer. Delete. Uh, I have moved them to the recycle bin. <laughs> Can I delete them? I am going to run CC Cleaner in order to complete the recycle The recycle bin has been empty. Uh, we have All right, one now other... delete. Oh. <laughs> we have one other thing we need to discuss. Sunrise Maiden. This is a stupid name for a sheep. Stupid. We can do it better. Uh, morning Glory? Sunrise Maiden Morning Glory. That's a horrible story. 
Let me think of a more stupid name than Sunrise Lane Maiden. Your name! That is stupid! <laughs> that is stupid! No, I like Nala. Nala's a nice name. We are not naming the sheep Nala. <laughs> that is stupid. Hey, stupid's not a nice word. Typically, uh, ships are often named after women. I think we should name this one. Weezy, I'm a woman. Weezy. Barely. <laughs> I, I, I was going to say uh, Smasher after the Vesk goddess of... <laughs> Smashing? Art. The art. Vesk goddess of art. Smasher. How dare I, you? I, I think, a I stereotype. Think, you are uh, racist. <laughs> I, would I, would like, like, I, I would like to... To, to, to name it after one of my my, my child, Spartac. No, I am Spartacus. No, I am Spartacus. No, I am Spartacus. No, I am Spartacus. No, you are Ozzy and you are Ghost. We are Spartacus. We know who the kid is here. <laughs> I, I, I okay, okay, wait, 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 wait. I, I have I another name. name. How, How about we name, name it The Assassin? That's going to attract too much attention. How about the nice guys? <laughs> I think oh. if we had an evil campaign, that would be perfect. <laughs> we could name it uh, after my grandmother. What is the name of your grandmother? I can't remember. I, I thought I had it here. If, if wow, she must have been very important very. to you. If her name was Smasher, that would be really <laughs> weird. I would just say. <laughs> Fezla. Yeah. I, I particularly like Spaceball 2, The Search for More Money. I really like that's that That's a name. really long... You think that's going to fit on the side of a ship? It's a big ship. Computer. Access random name generator for spaceships. <laughs> Accessing. Uh, uh, if, if, if you, you go, go to fantasynamegenerators.com, fantasy fantasy you, you can, can find, find a spaceship, spaceship named... Name. <laughs> uh, I don't believe we need to uh, name it this minute. I think that we do. That's true. Oh, but I really Maybe we name, name it the SS... SS. How about we, we name it the SS Immortal? And Bob was pulling it up. <laughs> Perhaps we should. Oh my God, there's I wasn't. I wasn't kidding, Bob. Bob. That is a legit, legit weapon. I see. There you go. Barbara, <laughs> Cyclops, Nuria. I think that we should name it Barbara. <laughs> <laughs> Susanna. <laughs> How about we name it after our DM's youngest daughter? What the hell? Look. <laughs> Spartacus. We'll name it Spartacus. We we think we should name it Zasmiak after our friend who was killed on the on the Akrian. That poor bastard. Yes, the one you turned into a muppet. Oh, Minotaur. Uh, ah, this might be your last ride on uh, the ship. So what? <laughs> your friend were part of the crew. We <coughs> much time with us. But what if we went and cleaned tortoise. the Tortoise. I like tortoise. tortoise. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> we do not have to decide now. Maybe we shall find something that is going to fit our. our Maybe we'll possible. have this discussion in an email thread at a later date. Yeah, like an hour before we play next time. Yeah. That soon. Or we don't have to decide. It can the be spectral right box. Mm -hmm. You will. You will need to register it in some need... means. The jolly dancer. Is there a department of the special... tiny dancer? I have a suggestion. We give it. Uh, we take turns. This week, Nala names it. Captain Nala. Next week, I get to name it. And we will name the ship different names as we want, as we go. What if we each pick our favorite words, and then all together we make a ship name from our words? That is a problem if Captain Nala needs to talk to the other side, and he says, this is the USS Tortoise Spartacus Defiant Observer Smasher Nafala Fergus... Uh, calling Fergus. into you. That is a tongue twister. I said one word. On, on the Starship uh, name, name generator, spaceship, spaceship name generator, Big, Big Mama, Mama came up. <laughs> lollipop. It's a good ship, Lollipop. The good ship, Lollipop. It's a good ship. This is a very large ship, I believe, is it not? Perhaps we should call it the Titanic. It says the exterminator twice. Mm -hmm. That's how good of a name generator it is. Did you know the Titanic sank in that movie? <laughs> yeah, that was... I Did you that know that that movie, movie was based on a real thing? <laughs> no, it was not. That is an urban meme. No. How that was just a movie. Another ship is approaching. Another ship. Battle stations. Battle stations. 
A torpedo has been fired. Shields up. Evasive maneuvers. The shields were already. All right. So, I am going to. I ready the warp drive. Do you remember how we said we wanted to keep the game moving? With last, you know, when we were talking about what we want out of this. We're really sucking at that right now. This is role play. This, this is, this is role play. You are playing your characters. Role I don't have a problem. I'm, I'm sorry, I haven't pushed you along at all. Really. That's true. That is true. It's, we are in character, aren't we? You I are think in that character. We should name the ship. <coughs> okay. Uh, torpedo right now. Well, has the has the, the ship tried to help me? What was that? What do you mean the ship have to? Is, is what 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 vector is that? What about the short? Hold on a second. What's your vector? Oh, I like that. I think okay. you're loading ship. stuff up. Hang on one second, Mikey. You don't know if we're dead or alive. We have clearance, Clarence. <laughs> you don't know if you're dead or alive. Okay, so now what? It's taking the captain's station. Rod, Roger, over. Hunger, over? over? I, Alici, done. You're taking a science station? Yeah. He is over, over, and I am over, done. So Unger is over, over, and over is under, done. What? Huh? Uh, <laughs> that's, that's murder. Who? <laughs> First base. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, well, Jules, we need to get you to watch some more movies. Trigger's always piloting. Why would Trigger be piloting? All right. Ozzy, you are running a turret or something? Something like that. I don't know what we have for weapons. I sent, the I sent you the ship. It's four different weapons. Yeah. Here. You even pointed one out to us at the beginning. Captain, do you want to know weapons as well or in engineering? Oh, we need... Uh, Clara. You had yes. experience with... I think that's the way I wanted it to. Congratulations on Operation Suck. <laughs> More weapon experience or... I am capable of firing the weapons. Engineering. What am I here for? There are more than one weapon that you can handle. Weapons. Does this interface not switch between weapons? Yeah, that's, that's the thing I don't understand is how you handle when you don't have enough bodies to fill all the stations or if you have like eight weapons or... and seven people. Yeah. So Claire is capable of running a... a, a uh, Guys, we can, we can do stuff too. Guys, we can, we can do stuff. Do yes. You, you know what you need to do? I, 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 I think, think I think, think the best thing, thing for you guys, guys to do is, is not, not to do anything. anything. You can give them a turret each. We have we have like four different guns on the ship. Is it, is it possible, possible for them, them to accidentally, accidentally shoot, shoot the, the ship, ship Josh? Josh? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> then they can get a turret. All right. So the Gobbles operate it will operate. Whatever you guys choose it's for them to operate. Go uh ghost, are you going to the engineering or are you gonna stay? I'll do engineering. Right. You can do that from the bridge for, for entering stations. Okay. If you have to do something in the back, we'll have to move you back there at some point. Sounds good. We can call that a hall. Hmm? Yeah. We can call it. If only you had a technology to be able to communicate. Right down the hall. How, many, how many ships? It's a single ship, sir. So we really only need to have two things firing at once. Because we have forward, port, starboard, aft, and turret. So the turret and one other thing can fire at a time. And one of those weapons, at least, can fire in all 360 degrees. That, yeah, the that's the turret. Okay, sorry, got it. It is a light particle beam. Does anybody want to look at our ship? Do that in All right. If Josh is setting it up, maybe... Yeah, Josh... I was going to say... I'm assuming you said... Go ahead, Mikey. Is there an email somewhere, somewhere with the sh information? information? Yeah, but I, I think uh, Jules has it right now. Maybe Elise. I sent I sent this ship information earlier. You can read off some of the key statistics on the ship, like its shields and its uh, weapons. In the in the in the write up from the, the week. I know it's there, but it's for the the, people, well, for Mikey who doesn't have it, oh. doesn't have the paper. Um. So we've got shields, light is 60, 15 in each direction. Um, like Adam said, we have lots of different ways to shoot things. Um, What's our biggest, baddest weapon out of the four weapons? Uh, the definitely turret. the turret. It's, the turret is 3d6, light particle beam. <clears throat> yeah, and then after that is the aft, which is a flak thrower that's 3d4. Yeah, we actually want things to be behind us as far as uh, attacking goes. So okay, yeah. you're a gunner. Pilot. That's my cute little cheat sheet here. Um, Do you want me to put the ship? Jules, your, oh, science sure science. You yeah. your science officer? She's science. Your science officer? Yes, I know you have yours. Well, Jeff do is, you want to read about the ship? Sure. Jeff is the captain. I have my little, I'm handing out my little cheat sheets here so everybody has what, has what they have. Mike, yeah, I'll have yours in front of me, so, I, so I'm going to give it to Bob so he can help you. It's not my own things to take care of. Like, <laughs> uh, is it, Josh, is this similar from a piloting from the left? Same as the last spaceship battle we did. Uh, except this time you do not have perfect maneuverability. Correct. Here, Mikey, here's the link to a cheat sheet. I just put in the chat window on roll 20. 
And okay. if you click on that link, there's a, the far right hand column gives you a list of all of your pilot actions. No, it's just because I can't line the grid up with. Actually, and it looks like this is there. including the errata because I see the DC 15s instead of the DC 10s. So it looks like they they're using the most recent rules. <coughs> Requesting fly. All right, so the torpedo comes in. Uh, how do I handle the torpedo? I'm sorry, guys. Wait, they fired on us already? I, yes, I said the ship entered uh, entered combat range and fired a torpedo at you. Surprise attack. Yes. I'm trying to. Uh, also, if you have the uh, what's we call it, the book, Starship Combat starts on three sixteen. Yeah, but it goes for like ten pages. Well, you can pick the section you want to look at. I want the part where it says torpedoes, but I don't see that. When you, yeah, I'm not concerned about that. As far uh, as I'm concerned, the torpedo missed. It depends on who, on your ship. You t you have to figure out who on your ship is the gunner. They will roll a one d twenty plus their base attack bonus or. Uh, that or their piloting rank plus their dex bonuses uh, plus any range penalties. And then that goes against our starship's AC. So what am I rolling? <laughs> uh, start with your 1d20. Roll low. Roll low. <laughs> Eight. That's, uh... That could be good, could be bad. Um, now what is, our ship has an AC of 13. So what is your base attack bonus on your gunner? So my modifier, complement. Or if they have piloting ranks. So gunnery, I have a plus seven. So and piloting, I have a plus seven. Okay, and if they do piloting, do they Oh, also I'm sorry, gunnery plus 12. So I have a 20 right now. So that's going to hit us because our AC is 13. All right. So the torpedo has struck. All right, so that is... Where did it strike us? All right, so I have... If Bob put the screen down so we can see it. Apologies. No, you're, you're helping me here. Um, I, Where's our ship? You're toward the bottom. There it is. You were on the right there on the left. I have randomly placed you because I really didn't have it in me. To, I don't have the... That's you on the right. So they are targeting. I will say you didn't manage to face them. Jeff's already asleep. So what are you talking about? Going, There's a lot of He's assuming the position, though. He's got his arms folded. His head was down. Yes. Uh, except for his eyes being closed. So it's going, going, to, down, uh, it's right. going to hit your four shields for no, nine. Niner. Niner. So that means we only have six up there. So what do your four shields have left? Six. six. Okay. Are you keeping track of that? Yeah. Somebody has to keep track of that. I got it. Where are the pencils? There's a cup, right? Not where the cup went. I took it off because it's in the way. Oh, Got it. Back here. Take... All it's right. in the chat window. All right. That's better. All right, so now we roll our, our post piloting now checks. So I have a pilot plus eight. We don't get to fire turn fire? No, it was, it was a surprise that round. It was a surprise uh, round. Natural 20. I have 28 for my pilot. Ooh. Mikey, what do you got? For my piloting check? Yep. Uh, 22. Okay, so I rolled a natural 20, and I had plus 8, so I have 28. So That's you guys move first, and then I get to move. That's a good pilot. <clears throat> you don't want to be first in starship combat. Correct. Right? You want to go second. Mm -hmm. So you guys move your ship. Bob, you have to drive the ship. Uh, is is my, is, is, I'm, I'm assuming, assuming my ship, ship is already headed, headed back, back towards where, where we want to go. go. I faced your is ship toward the them. Okay, okay. so, so I've, I've, I've turned, turned the ship, ship towards them then. It is, yeah, it, it already is. So you can move up to whatever your, your range is. What's your range, Adam? What's the, what's I, the chip sheet? It got past I'm going to attempt to close the distance the before they can, they can arm their, their torpedoes. torpedoes. So you can, you can move. Oh, wait a minute. That, that sounds, sounds like, like a movie, movie I, watched. I watched. Yeah, I was going to say, three, one, five. <laughs> so you, you can move 10 Hunt squares. Hunt for Red <laughs> October. <laughs> you, you, 10 squares? Oh, we should name our ship the Red October. Oh, that's cool. I like that. All right, move 10 hexes, please. I, I, I can't. <laughs> you can. No, no, we can't. I can't move it. We don't have the ability to. What the? Herc. <laughs> I was, I, I was trying, but I promise. Oh, my server. What about Purple July? My, my, my connection to the server has, oh, been interrupted. All right, one, two, three, four, five. Is that move, you guys? You don't see the change. I saw. I saw, I saw you move that. that. I. We did not on our side. Oh, wow, I saw, I saw that. that. Do 
you want to disconnect and reconnect? Do you want <clears> me <throat> to disconnect and reconnect? No, maybe? no, it's me. Reset player. <laughs> I do I like, like the red October. October. That's a great name. Well, I'm glad I thought of that. I really think right. so. If I move, that's right five here. squares to there. Let's see if that showed up. <gasps> nope. I, 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 if I yeah. can see it, then the, I'm the odd man out. So let me go ahead and reconnect. Oh, there it, it moved. Yeah. So I moved you five squares that way. Is that part of where you want to go, Mikey? Yeah, yeah that's, that's fine. fine. I, I'm okay. okay. Do you want to move closer? Um, no, I don't know if that thing has like a tractor beam or can lock onto us and try, you know. So I don't want to get too too close to it. I want to point out though that um, right now we're still facing them. So if they fire again, we only have six shield points left. So you may want to do a flip and burn and put our back to them. And our back shooters are better. Yeah, it's three D four on our rear gun. Oh, okay. Okay. Well then, I wouldn't. Okay. Well then, we shouldn't have gone towards them. We should have gone more away from them instead of the. Five, five towards, towards them, them we, we should have ran, ran. <laughs> did you guys did you guys want to try to run we can do that too you don't have to fight what's your speed i, I would like to try. well we don't know what their speed is. their speed is 12. since i'm since, since, since i'm driving since i'm driving we're gonna run. you're gonna run we're gonna turn our ship around and we're gonna move 10 spaces as far away from them so we have to take five that, spaces if 10 because our turn if 10 is our move I, 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 I what is our what is, what is our movement? Like I'm fine with just speed is speed is ten. All right, so you're gonna yes. Our speed is ten. I say I we make space, space tracks. tracks. Gonna catch up to so They're one, nice two, study. three, four, oh, five, six, seven, seven, eight, nine. So I think you can end up say circa here, facing that way, but you can't see that because freaking computers suck. I have been disconnected again. Mikey, can you see it? Where I moved your. I see it. Where, 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 yep, I, I'm, I'm good. good. Yeah. yeah. According, According to this, according to this grid, grid, it looks like, like we can only move diagonally. diagonally. Yeah, well, it's, that's how hex works. You can only move the connected sections. No, I know. That's <laughs> so, yeah, yeah, so. Trying to reconnect. So, that, so, that's, so that's, that's good. good. <clears throat> there. You should have rammed them. <laughs> Ramming speed. <laughs> All right. Um, the whole maneuver. Yeah. So they're going to move their 12. Does, Does this, this look, look like... like Uh, wait, I think we missed a phase. Before the pilot, that's the helm phase, right? Isn't there the engineering phase? No, pilot is... Oh, I see, yeah. Did we miss a phase? I think so. Okay, so engineer, so... Well, this Jules is all could... part of the helm I'm phase. I'm science officer. I think the helm phase is... I can be the engineer. No, I've got engineering. I had a cheat sheet for this, but I can't... Go, yeah, yeah. Go, Ghost, Ghost is, is the, the engineer. engineer. That too. I have the cheat sheet up right here. Of of uh, Starship Combat. Yeah. Look, it's all it's all here. Phases. See? Okay, so. <laughs> Bless you. Bless. Engineering, helm, gunnery. <clears throat> right. So the engineers each take an action to repair the stiff systems or to give them a, a boost. Yep. Um. So I at least he can. Scan their ship. She's the science out. officer. That's home phase. That's, That's home phase. Two. Okay. Mm -hmm. So engineering is is ghost. Yep. So I'm gonna uh, fix the shields. Are you gonna fix the shields? Or you want to go Are faster? Because because trigger one to run away. I, I don't know how fast the ship is yet. So I'm fixing the shields. That's my priority. I don't know how fast the enemy ship is. So until I do, our shields are down to six. I also don't believe that you have the ability to quick the, to fix the shields. Oh, the science officer can balance the shields. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, okay, then I guess I'll uh, divert power to the engines. Okay, what does that give you? Uh, if I succeed, I can increase the speed by two for this round. Okay. So it's a DC ten on engineering. What's our What's our starship's tier? Three. Oh. Three. You're right, there's an extra roll So in it's there. plus six. So it's 16. 16. <sighs> and I rolled a 23. So you get two extra move? You get two extra. You can, he matches, he can only match your speed, he can't gain on you. All right. 
All right, speed, speed oh, is at 12. You can, I'm sorry, you can... Oh, wait, even you can divert to shields. Yeah, or, yeah, if shields restore an amount of shield points equal to 5% of the PCU, our PCU value is 150. 10% wow. is 15, 5% is 7.5. So 7. So we so, can restore all, all that shields. Or, yeah, almost back to full shields. I thought we took 6, my bad. You took 6, so you would restore to full shields. Oh, I thought we were. We no, took we took nine. nine. Oh, you took we're nine. Down six. to yeah. six. Oh, we, we took, took nine. nine. Yeah, we, we took, took nine. nine. So that would set our shields back up to thirteen. I think that's better than just not getting, not getting. You know. I agree. Yeah. So, if, with your permission, I would prefer to use that to go to shields instead of. Captain, what shields. are you saying? I guess so. All right, Captain. Shields are now at thirteen instead Let's of. Evenly six. distribute to the rest. Oh, to the all four quadrants. We're only taking damage in one quadrant. Right. There's only two down, so it's not. That's not bad. All right, so they move to catch up to you. So that's engineering, and then we pilot, and then we attack. Now, Captain... Well, sorry, not pilot. At any point, Captain... I could give a bonus. You can give a bonus. And our ship also allows any one of us to add uh, two times per full turn one point to one of our rules. So two people can add one point to their rules. Okay. Keep that in mind. Oh, what are you going to okay. do, science officer? Maybe you Is should look at that. Chance? Yeah, maybe you should look at what you can do rather than look at your phone. So you can shift shield points. Joel, good job. From one quadrant to another. I know that. But you don't really need to because we're at 15, 15, 15, 13. Maybe we could scan them. Well, we could all... We, yeah, yeah, we can't really shift, shift them because you can't go above, above what the 15, 15 is, right? Right. All right. So go ahead and scan them. Do I have to roll for that? Yes, you do. It's okay, Joel. <coughs> roll your computers. Ugh. 17. So it's DC is equal to 10 plus the tier of the starship being scanned plus is the bo bonus from defensive countermeasures. So the tier 2. Oh, it's tier two. 3. Their ship, Their is, tier ship two. is tier 2. No, no we're, we're, we're tier, tier three. 3. So 1.5 times 2. No, it's just straight. Oh, okay. So, so you were able to scan them. So you well, were able... it has no defensive countermeasures? No. So the target's a 9 and you rolled a 17. So you exceeded the target by 8. So we've only... Put the phone down. This check first note. So we get basic information and defenses. I agree. Okay, so basic information it is a Thalmtech Karn Carver. It's a light oh. freight, uh, a small light freighter, Eoxian. Uh, what's with the Eoxians? We need to kill us. Oh, yeah, um, right. Defensively, it has um, 10, 10, 10, 10 for shields. Oh, okay. Uh, ACTL total current hull points. Uh, AC is 15. Hard uh, to hit. I don't remember what TL is. Uh, target lock. Okay. You guys aren't there yet. That's Core PCU value. Core yep. PCU value? Mm -hmm. I don't know what that means. Uh, oh, core, pulse core, uh, 120 core, PCU. 120. Whatever that means. However that translates. <laughs> we didn't get weapon information, though. No. Just Don't rely on that. All right. But if we do another scan. So now we into gunnery? They moved. Oh, well, we have... Um, sorry. Do we complete our whole turn? I forget how this goes. We all forget how this because I'm ready to scrap it. Just move on to the game. With, with no, the, no. We, <laughs> we don't do this one never. Really. This I know. Is a mini game. I understand, Unless but we, scrap all we, we should we should have prepped a little harder for this. I should have prepped too. Work did not allow me to prep today. I thought we printed these out too. The, uh... That's why you have a cheat sheet in front of you. No, I thought we had like this. I didn't find it when I was cleaning just the other day, but it doesn't mean it wasn't but here. But now uh, it would be the pilot move. Which we did. Which we did on our side, and your pilot. Has I, moved. I moved up. I, cl I, I closed I the up. distance. Oh, okay. He's right there. So uh, you guys, we all fire at the same time now. <clears throat> okay. Uh, well, do we have any um, um, actions from you? I, I want to uh, give our gunners a an advantage. Encourage, okay. encourage. Uh, demand, or taunt. Probably encourage. Okay. Thank you. So go ahead and roll your diplomacy. And you gotta. I'm gonna go for the who's that? Who's on the turret? Who's on the turret? Mm -hmm. Yes. Oz, hey, about them. Give them your best shot. And and we can add a plus one to any two rolls every Correct. every round. Mm -hmm. So it should be probably this roll. <laughs> we want Clara and the goblin. Oh, that's right. Well, what do you have? Sure, I got a roll of thirteen. What's that? You're only shooting aft or turret right now. Well, we can do both. Yes. 13, DC 15. 13. Oh, that's too bad. You okay. lack encouragement. Instead of diplomacy, you may attempt a DC 10 skill check for the skill being encouraged. So you can and do a gunnery, you can do a piloting skill for gunnery. Hmm. 
That's plus two. No, it's too late. Yeah. I think I know what to do by now. Shoot the bad guys. I get it. <laughs> All right, who wants to roll? Jules wants to roll for Clara. I know what, what she's shooting. What are you shooting? What's Clara shooting? Uh, I'm, well, I'm shooting the turret. Well, so that's 3d6. If I hit, I'm going to take a plus one to this roll. Uh. <laughs> well, nine and seven is uh, 16. 16 plus one is 18. They have, an AC, they have an AC of 15. So I hit. You hit. Ooh, nice. Okay, so what's 36 I have damage. Hold on one second, Jules. We're going to get to you in a second. Uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Ooh. Eleven. You blew out the shields. The front yeah. shields are taken out. Front shields are out. Bye bye. Ten, ten, ten. And they took one point of damage in the front. <coughs> yeah. They took one point of HP damage. There's uh, a big scratch right across that wood chip. But we do. You do have to keep track because if they pass yes. a damage threshold, yes. certain things happen. All right. Now, what, what's the other? What's the aft weapon? It's a flat cannon. Three D four. The flat. What'd you roll? I rolled a thirteen. Does three D does three D four da- So do you, on the D twenty, what do I? Have oh, so you have Clara. Uh, so we have to see how good Clara is. <coughs> with weapons. Uh, yeah, it would be either we need a plus base attack two. bonus plus Dex or a piloting plus Dex. Mm-hmm. Which I assume it'd be piloting. I don't think it's is it base attack plus Dex. I thought it was just flat base attack. Uh, on here it's just base plus, but it might have been eroded. Because uh, I I got it here just base attack. Or she has piloting plus thirteen. Oh, okay. oh, oh. 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 <laughs> and what's so your twenty six? What's your dex bonus? Do you, is there like different tiers of hitting? If she has ah, one. maybe you can go on the turret next turn. Or... Dex is plus four. <laughs> so it's plus seventeen. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm gonna> say... <laughs> Clara is plus seventeen on her gunnery. Right, three d six damage. Three d four damage. Three d four. Why are you guys correcting me when I was wrong in the game? Strong. Take that. Don't, don't misspeak again. I know, right? Say that, Sorry, I'm trying to cheat in our favor. Oh, nice. Nine. Linger. Ooh. Is there any bonus to that? I don't think I don't so. Know. It's damage. No. All right, so they dropped a 30 out of 40, which means they've lost a critical system. <gasps> I believe. They're gonna Do we get... get to pick which one? No, you get to roll for which one. No, let me find the freaking... <clears throat> As a science officer, you can target a system, and then when they fire, the they'll hit a system. All right, uh, roll a d100, Jules. Me? Yes, you you did damage. Oh. This is special. Is this hey, book, or is this only in the DMG? It's, it's, on, it's on, on 321. 71. Mm. You damage the engines. Condition nice. applies to all pilot actions. So it is glitching. A glitching system isn't operating at peak performance. Crew actions involving the system, except to hold it together, together. <coughs> minus two penalty. So all piloting checks are minus two right now. That's great. That's a good but, one. But that, can be, that can be overridden by the somebody. Engineer can fix that damage. Yes. They can patch it. All right. So now I go <coughs> back to the top. We go, wait. We have the goblins. There's, they can't fire at anything. Well, they can't? No. We don't have any guns in that direction. Are, they're each other. They're each other. We, we, yeah, we have four guns in each of the cardinal directions, and then one turret that's a 360 oh, rotation. So they could fire if it was in that direction. Yes. They're not pointing in that direction. Got it. Look at me shooting that dust. Choo, 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 choo. That's good. You keep pushing the button over there. That's right. You got him good. Good job. You have them on the simulator, right? Right, exactly. <laughs> Excellent. All right, uh, next piloting check. <clears throat> oh, okay. Nope, not piloting check. So engineering. So their engineer is going to attempt to fix their glitching system. Um, yep. I like any good engineer. What's would. our engineering going to do? Um, I rolled a one. Well, to make it worse? <laughs> no. I failed the skill check. There's no systems for us to patch. There's nothing damaged enough that we need to hold it together. So I should probably divert. Wait a bit. Did I not shoot you? You did. We... You torpedoed us. Oh, no, no. You did, did not take it. your... No, you, you only got the... Gun. I didn't take my, my attacks this turn. turn. Yes, you're right. I did not take my attacks this turn. I only had the torpedo. <laughs> and don't forget, if you have a captain, your captain can encourage your gunner. So the first one is a natural 16 with the... Uh... Automatic hit. We've got an AC 13. Okay, so light particle tor- light particle beam does 3d6. That sounds familiar. Mm. That's worse than what we have. That was four, five, oh, six, seven. And then the torpedo fires again. Ele- natural 11 plus uh, wait, 12 is 22. So you're never going to not hit us. It's going to be hard for me not to hit Where you. does the seven strike? Aft. No, no, I mean, if you roll a one, you, you hit us. What? 
Is, does distance mean anything? It can. I didn't. I think torpedo. Yes. We're ignoring it for now. Yeah, okay. Because I'm sure our flat can in a short range too. Well, we kind of project so ten more damage too. I mean, there's no grab. Okay, there's no gravity so or anything like that. Aft so. shields are at zero. Well, so aft shields, shields have failed, Captain. Aft no shields resistance. have failed. Well, like an energy weapon would hit there. Yeah. Wait a minute. How did they, we? We had fifteen in aft shields. How much damage did we just? They hit you twice. They hit for seven, and then they hit again for uh, for ten for seventeen total damage. Oh, okay. okay. So we took two damage a hit point. Exactly. With two, two actual hit points. Right. In our hull now... <clears throat> is... really need to get control. So you can not be in their front. 53. Know. We got 53 hit points left. They are down to 30. Yep. All right, I fixed my glitching system. No, I failed that. I rolled a one. I failed that. I, I jumped ahead on that. Uh, well, are do, you guys do doing you want to try to, Do you want to change that and attempt to shield? To, well, I guess it would be the same yeah. either way. Yes. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and restore shields. Uh, You're going to balance them? Divert. Uh, the science officer balances. Oh. All I can divert is... Divert. No, no, no. Yeah, so so this is the engineering phase again, right? That's yeah. right. Yes. So, so I'm going to go ahead... So and captain and engineer go? Captain right. can go anytime he wants. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and I'm going to take... Am I going to take one of those points to make this? No, nah, it'll be fine. Uh, the DC was what again? 1.5 times tier plus 10? 15 plus 2 times your tier... So 16. Yeah. Okay. I think I got this. 20. Oh, 15 plus. Oh, that's moving. Sorry. So that's a success. And therefore, uh, 5% of 150 it was seven. is 7. Yeah, so seven and a half at 7. Half shields go back up to 7. I will give you 8 since you lost the other half last time. Hmm? The no, first half. Okay. okay. I'll take it. Sure. <laughs> oh, he's out. Which Ish. Moves. <laughs> so, uh, pilot, just so you know, our aft shields are at half, pretty much at eight. All the other shields are you. maxed out at fifteen once again. So we're rebalancing. So we're good. Well, we have piloting next, right? Uh, yes. So, uh, you got science roll. officer can go before the pilot. No, pilot has to go first. If we need science office. No, it says right there on the sheet. The science officer can act before or after the pilot in the. It, so this is all part of the helm phase. Okay. okay. It's up to so let's roll. So in the in the helm in the helm phase, the captain, the pilot, and the science officer all get right. And whatever order the they captain gets to act in all three. Yes. Yeah. The captain. Well, the captain can act whenever he wants. She. 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 I roll the natural eight she. minus two is six, so I think Mikey is probably going to get access to the. You still get your plus eight though for piloting. Yes. So I have a ten. Yeah. No, I have a. I was gonna say that's not how that math works. Yeah, no. Even I know that. Fourteen. So, so yeah, I have a fourteen, Mikey. I need to put a better so thirteen, twenty-three, twenty. I have a twenty. I messed that up. Already. This is a different one. Oh, All right. That means that the enemy is going first. Your yes. twenty-three beats the fourteen. Yes. Are you science or engineering? Would you do anything ahead of time? Do you want to target a system? Yes. Okay. There are. They're already. You've already injured their pilot. So you want to target their piloting system further? No, I want to target their weapons. Okay. Okay. Because it says the next successful attack to hit the target ship deals critical damage to that system. Okay. That's true. true. That sounds good. Do you want to take the plus one from the ship's computer to help you with your targeting? Sure. All right. (laughs) Roll computers. Roll well. I uh... I say you want to... Yes. Yes, you do. You can use your Benny. Use your... Was it that bad? <laughs> what did you roll? Three. This many. Wait, but what's your plus from computers? Nine. So three plus nine is twelve, plus the one point is thirteen. What's the DC to to hit this? Fifteen plus the tier of the enemy starship plus bonus from defensive countermeasures. Oh, that's not gonna happen. No. Okay. Yeah, yeah use your bet. Thirteen. Three. three again. Really? <laughs> <laughs> There should be a rule that you can't re-roll the same number. <laughs> you should, you, should, you know what? The rule should be you can't re-roll the same die. Yeah. Okay. I think that we should institute that starting right now. You know, we should retcon that to three seconds ago. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Two. Sixteen. Okay. 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 Plus nine. That's twenty-five. All right. So you've locked on their weapons array. Nice. Good job. I like this. this is All right. So they now have it's uh, pilots have finished. So well, now pilot, we still have to you. maneuver. Maneuver. Disappointment. That's right. So they go first. 
When does maneuvering happen? I feel like that should be its own phase. That's phase two. That's the pilot phase. That's all part of the helm phase? Yeah. Okay, I have moved. Uh, Mikey, it is up to you. Uh oh. You have a you have a move of ten. And don't forget if you want to change if you want to change the direction of the ship, you need five spaces to do that. Our F it's, it's, are... we can, I think we can turn one for each one we move. Okay. So if we wanted to do a full 180, I don't know. You can well, we don't need to do a full 180, right? I just, we want to be able to. Because you guys want you guys want to continue firing with the aft guns. We more. I would assume. Mike, we want to be able to target. We probably don't want to target the aft. Use the aft gun, but we want to be able to target the front of their ship, which is which is facing you. So because they, they want to target you with the front, because that's where they have their weapons. Okay. But their front is uh, okay, so um, I mean, I Josh, are we they... literally going to run out of grid here, or does it keep going? It keeps going. Or you, okay. or you can just drive so off can the you... top left. Can we just run out of space? Yeah. Or maybe well, it's I like can't move, so can can maybe you it's like asteroids? Move, move me. And... You flip over this. Here. There was oh yeah, move us all the way back. There's a motor. That's fine. Too. You hit the edge of back. <clears throat> okay. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So if you just move us straight ahead nine, that puts us back, or ten. That there. literally puts us back. No, nope, not that. That's straight up. Like that way? Yes, that way. Keep going straight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. They're shooting at our aft again. But there's that, you've got our aft... Uh, pointed at them, and our aft is our weakest right now at, at eight points of shield. Just to know. Right, but their front is also has no shields. That's where their weapons are. Okay. And okay. our two weapons that fire next do the most damage. Fair point. That's fair. You've actually. And by the way, we are locked. Actually... We are targeting their weapon system as well with our attack. That's yep. true. That's Ozzie, true. Ozzy, there's a reason why you're on this ship. Show me what you're on this ship for. Don't Ooh, wait. Ooh. That sounds like a demand. Wait. Was that a demand? That's a demand. Did you uh, roll successfully? She's, he's, she's still he's still working on it. Nope. He also rolled a three. <laughs> it's a Do your best. DC fifteen. I'm here to kill things. I don't know why you need to keep telling me my own job. All right, eleven and niner is a twenty. <laughs> that will hit. All right. Nice. Uh, three d six damage. Okay. By so the way, Josh, that was only seven. That was only seven spaces you moved us. So. Sure. So that's critical damage to the weapon systems. Okay. Does that mean they're just glitching now? They're glitching now. Let's see. My roll does not suffer for that damage. Ooh. Oh my god. What did you roll? Eight and six is 14. 14. Ooh, that's another tier as well. Maybe two. I don't know. Yeah, I think it's two. They, they do get to shoot as well. And Clara yeah, gets to shoot. Sh Clara? Oh. I think it's hard for Clara to miss. Clara's going to pick. She's plus 17. 19. All right, roll your damage. It's, it's going to be yeah, 3d4. We're still shooting with that flat cannon in the back. We should get the ranges on those. Oh, I want to clarify. Because I have no doubt that that's long range for this thing. When you target the weapon, <clears throat> it just increases your crit range. Instead of a 20, it's a 19 and a 20. So she just crit. Jules, you rolled a 19, right? I rolled a 10. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, it's damage. ten out of twelve. Right? It has to be a natural nineteen. I meant your 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 hit yeah, roll. We need to re roll. Oh, it's a nat nineteen. You, I know. Right here. Okay, so Jules was just rolled a natural nineteen. Jules. Natural nineteen is crit only because her science officer gave her that ability. Okay, so that's double damage. So. Uh, well, this is Clara. This isn't. She's it's okay. Gunner, not science officer. It yes. is a critical hit I because think. the science officer oh, targeted right. the weapons. It what? doesn't say double damage, but it what? it does say it affects the chosen system. Right, so I think I think it means that that system not glitches. Yes. It so, says the next successful attack to hit that part of the ship deals critical damage to oh, that. Oh, okay. System. So that was just my attack because I was the next attack. Right. So I dealt critical damage to weapons. This is just damage. Damage. Yes. So that did just ten points. I I think I, I'm interpreting it slightly differently. What are you looking? Oh, at? Just, just, I'm just, look right here. On the, what I've got highlighted. Right it, it is it is ambiguous because I've read it, it and, and misread it. I've, I've had two different inspections. Let me get my let me get my attacks in and then we'll, we'll go from there. Okay. A natural sixteen is a hit. A natural eighteen is a hit. That's going to be against our aft. We're going to lose our aft shields, I think. <laughs> wow. Well, that's what you're here for. Six, the next attack made six, by seven, the starship that hits the enemy. Twelve, twenty, <clears throat> twenty-eight damage to your aft. Ooh. So aft shields are down to zero, and we've taken 20 hit points, which is definitely 
a a tier. What is a tier? Ten points or something? Yes. They they actually turn to flee. Okay. Wait a minute. I thought their weapons were glitching. That just means they take a minus two. They, no, weapon. All the weapon stuff happens at once. Next turn they be glitching. Okay. So. And I actually rolled a sixteen and an eighteen, so it wouldn't matter. And so, Bob, what it says is okay. So first of all, the next attack made by your starship that hits the enemy ship scores a critical hit on natural roll of 19 or 20. Exactly. My roll hit. I rolled next. But you did not roll a 19 or 20. No, but I hit. Right. I hit. So the next attack that hits the enemy starship scores a critical hit on a natural roll of 19 or 20. I hit. I did not get a 19 or 20. Right. So that part is, is, is not in play. I agree. Okay. I agree. Continuing on. Uh, if that attack deals critical damage, which it did... Ah, because you broke a tier. It so affects not... the weapon system. So instead of rolling, their weapons were glitched. So there are two ways that you can create the damage to the system. One is by natural 19 or 20. And the second is if you exceed the 10-point critical threshold. So even if you didn't hit the 19 or 20, like in your case, you still did so much damage that it affects the yeah. specific system. It's, it's talking about because it's critical hit. All right. And then we, we, can, we can hammer this out. It doesn't matter. They're retreating. You've reduced them to six hit points. They're well, running away. We want to do a little bit of learning. I think we're done yeah. anyway. Yeah. Yes, that's what I'm applying. Any further critical damage is random is normal. So it, it bypasses the rolling for random if you exceed the... But threshold. only one time. Agree. Okay. And then there's also critical hitting, which we don't know what that does. If it's double damage or not? <laughs> I would assume so. we got to look that up. But yeah, we, we need to learn some We more can here. do that another time. Yes. We can, okay. We're targeting their engines? They're fleeing. They're fleeing. They're faster than us. Try to chase. Let's kill them, Captain. Don't let them get away. You guys, you guys just took another you're, you're, 18 you're, points or whatever it was. was it, did, two or F. Did, did we take a critical? Oh, yeah, yes, we took we two criticals. We have to roll. They have to roll to see what systems are glitched on our side. We're down to 33 points out of 55, and our F shields are gone. Okay, 27 to 43. Twenty-seven. Your sensors are down, and your weapons are right. Your weapons. So a sensor glitch. Gl yeah. And a weapons glitch. <laughs> so funny. Okay. And they're turning to flee. Yes, they are. Right, they are fleeing. So they're heading away from Absalom Station. They are heading. Yes. In fact, you're, 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 you guys are um, picking up, Captain. Other ships are approaching. Identify. They appear to be. Uh, they're, they're, their beacon is saying they are stewards. They are hailing the other ship and telling it to stand down. Follow the other ship. I, I, they're here for they're here for our defense. Let's get home. They are here for our offense. Let's attack, Captain. <laughs> uh, hail them. Hail. Hailing who? Stewards. Stewards. Hello, uh, sun, sun, is this the Sunrise Maiden? Yes. For now. <laughs> <laughs> Is, it, is this the Starfinders that are on the drift? These park? are the Starfinders. Yes, the 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 uh, we are well, we are familiar with who you are based on the reality feeds that we've been watching. Oh, uh, we have been attacked by that uh, Yelkin ship. Yes, we've identified that as a corpse fleet vessel. We are taking care of it for you. You have echo. Uh, you need to turn off the robot cell feed on your ship. We are getting <laughs> echo right now. Can you stop watching us while you're talking to us? Or as they used to say back in the day, turn your radio down, asshole. Turn your radio down. <laughs> but it's so entertaining to watch you. I know. We just got attacked. Go get them. Very well. Engaging. <laughs> Engage. <laughs> Thank you. The uh, the corpse sleeve vessel. You guys, yeah. you guys left them. There wasn't much left. It, these guys just take it apart in no time at all. Board the ship. Let us board the ship. There's nothing left. There's nothing left to board. I want to interrogate somebody. They're dead. I they mean, are, they're double dead. We don't know that. <laughs> it's true. They could they're, just be floating in space. They're dead undead. Scabby <laughs> sheep. Are they undead dead or dead undead? <laughs> dead undead. Oh, but if they are undead and then they get killed and then you bring them back. Are they undead undead? Yeah. Undead dead. dead. Ooh. Undead dead. dead. <laughs> okay, on that note. Alrighty. You uh, are cleared for docking at Docking Bay 94, of course. Docking Bay 94. I don't so feel good about this docking bay. Can we I feel like we should get a different docking bay. I agree with the little one. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, Can we what's have the name a docking bay 93? Yeah. Sunrise Maiden. Uh, Sunrise Maiden to Absalom Station. Uh, request, here. request another docking bay. 
Uh, I'm sorry. Do you have a big three and uh, nine and three quarters? Have you removed the blood stains <laughs> from? from can I give her a penny for that? She can have her penny back for that. <laughs> um, That's um, good. The. Uh, I'm sorry. That is the only. If you want to wait an hour, you can wait an hour. That's our, our next available option, or you can dock there. We already have arranged for security to be there to help escort you off, as you are somewhat of a minor celebrity now. Oh okay. yeah, Captain. Have we scanned our ship for life signs or other things like stowaways? I do not believe that we have done these. Computer. Yes. Do we scan our ship, our vessel, for life signs? Life. Never. Um, I don't know that. I, I count the. Well, you got six, seven, eight. Ish. Let's there's say there's five eight. of us: two goblins, Clara, and Clara. Eight. We note. Uh, and Robo Cell. I am able to locate eight life forms and a wandering drone. Did you, <laughs> computer? Did you scan the exterior of the ship as well? Oh, that's good. Alien. There, yeah, there is nothing also, attached to the exterior there, of the ship. There's actually an encounter. I'm choosing not to run. Only because I'd rather move on with things. It's not. It's not that. It's not a critical encounter. It's not exciting at all. Okay. I actually considered having an attack during the spaceship, but that would have just way too much to complete because we can't. We don't need spaceship combat. <laughs> so, there was a stowaway. There would have been a stowaway. This security precaution would have been good, but we should have done it like a while. You know what? Ago. That's like saying, oh, "I wonder if this is a doppelganger." <laughs> ah. <laughs> we were too late in scanning, anyways. We should have done it as soon as we got off the drift. Yeah, not so, two hours later. Yeah, it, it, it's it was a minor encounter. It's it, not a big deal. It, I just wanted to use some of our cool new level three. Or, no, you'll uh, get your chance. Don't I actually have a any combat coming up? Oh, so are we level three like, now? Like when exactly do we level one? You're level three. Okay. Woo! It's level three. Yeah, level three. <laughs> that was very dramatic. Throwing away. That's very old. dramatic. Yes. It was like a snake molting right there. Right? <laughs> as, as, as you guys are his as you guys are pulling into docking bay ninety four. Um, you have a few minutes while the automated process takes over, factors you in. And that's when we magically level up. And, and, and Clara goes, unless you have need of me, I plan to disappear into the crowd. Uh, we have need of you. you. You need to answer for your crimes. I have, I helped you to get off of that rock. I have yes. helped you escape that, that space yeah. battle. I'm sorry, you helped us get off the rock how? I fought, I fought beside you. As I as I as I um while I while I um understand what you're saying, can can you come can you come help me back here in 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 in, in literally why of course trigger I turned it to thank you Sarah. say don't move keep her bound everyone <laughs> okay I um I I uh, I use I use the secret language Ghost and I have developed. And I basically give him the key to just let her go. The paladin has been sufficiently distracted. Go do your evil things. <laughs> what, what happened to us? Can we stay? We're, we're valuable members of the crew. I think. Oh, yeah. We're, no, we're keeping you. Feely. Feely. Uh, yes, I shall call you Father. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And father too. Every ship needs to have gremlin. Felraz runs up and, and, and gives Trigger a big hug. It's kind of like it's it's really uncomfortably awky. gawky. They're a, both three that, feet tall. Is that fortitude or will? <laughs> <laughs> they both have to have some engineering skills. Yeah, a, a, every ship needs to have gremlins. We have our own. Awesome. At least we can see these gremlins, right, Mikey? Ship to... Every ship needs. Cameras. That's exactly yes. <laughs> that is what we need. <clears throat> That's the kind of gremlin I like. One I can see. Oh, cool. Uh, Do you want us to stay on the ship, or can we get off too? You are getting off. No, no, no. You can, you can come off. You, you, you can certainly you can give, come off. You can give the AI information to say don't don't accept anything other than like open and close doors from the goblins. That's what I suggested earlier. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, we, we give them that command at this. I think any any, any time that let, they let, want to do something with an interface, they get a simulated screen. <laughs> That's like when you're uh, playing a video game with your little brother, and you and you give them the controller phone. that's unplugged. Exactly. That's that's what we're doing with the same goblins. thing. Absolutely. <laughs> Uh, Clara. Yes. 24-7. Here is my contact information. 24-7. If you need assistance or you can provide information on who hired you, contact me. When did he become French? He's always been French. No, he's been more Russian before. No. No, he was Russian before. Yeah, he was Russian before. I never went for Russian. 
you were thicker. thicker. But anyway, no, you tore both. You were tore both a different type of French. Dexter's Lab meets. Uh, uh, shoot, there was one more. Oh, uh, Ren and Stimpy. That's, Stick around for two minutes. Yeah. Stick around for two minutes. Yeah. All right, it's definitely her, Dexter's lab. She she gives you a, 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 a contact information card as well. Okay. I assume yours is more of a drop spot than anything else since you don't really have a... Yep. Oh, I'm sure hers spot. is too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah that's so they arrange for some security as the... the uh, it's, not a, it's not a hatch. You come, you come out a door more other than the ship is an airlock. As, as you come out, there are... The docking bay is just full of people. It, it is just pandemonium. Everybody is excited to see you. You are absolutely uh, reality stars on, on, on the infosphere. Your 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 names the names are plastered everywhere. Perhaps we can set up a Skype with Chiskix. Before we go out, I uh, make sure your disguises are uh, in place. And, uh... Thank you. Um, I get a hat and pull the brim. I mean, there 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 there's a couple yeah. of security guards who are completely outclassed. They can't they can't even keep people at bay. Never mind form away form away for you to get through. Um, there are people are reaching over trying to touch you, just like oh, it, it's just fantastic. Um, Do I see press? Horrible. Oh yeah, just, just there's thirty other drones floating around. There's just everything you can pop. It's like a, it's like a rock star landed. Excuse me, excuse me. Uh, I have a very important announcement to make. I encourage all of you to spend your money at Lana Diamond Norquisco, uh-huh. the Soki shop. Lana Diamond has excellent <laughs> wares, and I am a personal supporter and sponsor of this excellent store. And uh, ghost, I'm ghost, 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 ghost. We should we should tell them to go spend their money in our bar. Yes. Oh uh, yeah. yes, and oh, also right. the, bar. the best <laughs> bar on the station is the Cold Fusion Station. After you buy your item from Lana Diamond, go get a smooth, refreshing drink and possibly some drugs at Cold Fusion. <laughs> Don't forget that she has to see you there. Yeah, maybe we have And a, who uh, knows if you are lucky, maybe you will see even Nala. If you are <laughs> unlucky, you will see Ozzy. If you are very lucky, you might see me. Who, who is the first off the ship? Money. Who is the first off the ship? Me. Goblins. There, there, are, there are microphones in your mouth. What, do you have anything to say? Oh, at least you. What, what? What? How was it? That was so exciting. Yeah, it was. What? 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 Could, what who could let? Who let her, her off the ship first? She, she more. I think she ran off the ship first. I can see her being the first off the ship. Yes. <laughs> She's never been a celebrity before. This is she new experience for ship. her. Yeah. This is exciting. This is new. She likes new things. Yeah. This is exciting. Okay. New. She likes new while things. while this is happening, She's Trigger this literally slipped. <laughs> So into the crowd. Yeah. Ozzy tries to melt into the crowd. I- impossible. <laughs> it, absolutely impossible for you to disappear into the crowd. Even Trigger? Can Trigger it, do it? Absolutely impossible. No. It, as, as, just when you Trigger guys, takes off as the sky. Trigger takes off as the skies. They don't even recognize. You, you, you. They, they trust me. There, there's just a, walls of people. Before, as you're starting to get uncomfortable, suddenly all the noise stops, and everybody parts. As Gervalar Snore and his group of undead Eoxian bodyguards walk up. Oh, like it's like it's the parting of the Red Sea. <laughs> Nobody hey. wants to be near them. Hey, <laughs> hey, I, I go... hey, 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 I see dead people. Oh, that. <laughs> this is the guy who called back our ship. Yeah. You owe us three husks of uh, Nora, 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 no qual. You owe us three husks of no qual. Yes, we will, we will settle up back in my and office. And my shoes. I left my shoes on this ship. We will settle up at my office. And also my two I left weapons. all I, I I left all these really expensive weapons on the. Sh- <laughs> also, I believe I drag Roboco Cell out. I believe this is yours. You actually have the opportunity to crush Roboco yeah. Cell in your hand at that point. Oh yeah, no, I was crushing him. <laughs> hey, that's so nice. I think I broke it. We, we left one. five cred sticks with ten thousand credits each on them on the ship. <laughs> also, also, we will take care of everything. Do not trust this one. <laughs> I do not trust anyone who does not have a pulse. Have a what? A pulse. A pulse. Must be common federation. We have. He gave us a boat. Pulse. No, a pulse. <laughs> a boat. A pulse. Pulse. U L S E. Pulse. Wait, like pole position? Do you not know how to spell? I just spelled it for you. Look at him. Does he look like he knows how to spell? Someone who's not made out of pulse. That is true, at least. That's what you say? It does not have bolts. Jeez. Wait a minute. Are you saying you inspected his um nether his regions? Bolts? I always check for bolts. Don't you look for bolts? 
He's got no pulse. He doesn't have tiny pulse. He doesn't have big pulse. He has no pulse. I heard that oh. some are held for charity and some for fancy dress. <laughs> <laughs> the ones that are held for pleasure are the ones that I like best. I'm going to go to bed now. I don't blame you. Can I go? <laughs> Good night. Oh, come on. If I didn't already have three bennies, that was totally Benny-worthy. That was good. Good night. It was. <laughs> so uh, That was definitely Benny-worthy. Pulling an ACDC song? Hell yeah. Nor and his, his guard. I just put you on that page you have Nor to look at. Uh, ah, can we not? <laughs> hey, the good thing is... Hey, guys. Guys, guys, guys. Guys, guys. guys. Oh, hey, good. maybe we could just follow him out of here. He managed to part the crowd. Yeah, he's escorting first. you back to his office to, to negotiate, to reward you for your... To pay you back. Negotiate. That oh yeah, thing. you're gonna. Re- I think we already negotiated our. our you did negotiate some, as I recall. Oh, but he changed our terms, and we are changing our terms now. If he does not, uh, you don't have a leg to stand on now. He did not honor. We have the entire uh, audience of the entire Salon Station, so, and he did not operate in good faith. You're saying we are altering our deal? Pray, pray that we do not alter it further. Yes. Uh, now you are getting it. So as as he. <laughs> Starts escorting you off the, uh, off out of Docking Bay. Mike, was that a giggle? Yes, it was. Nice. <laughs> his uh, his bodyguards filing behind you, forming a, you know, like a, a, a an entourage completely surrounding you. You're, you're you, really uncomfortable. Awkward. Really. It's it's almost like a, you're it's almost like you're in a, in a in a bowl of cold. I'm not sure which should be worse, being swarmed by this crowd or being surrounded by these things. Uh, Ozzy, give me a perception check. Yeah. <laughs> You're funny. <laughs> no. What is it? Uh, four. <coughs> no. <laughs> Why did you ask? Because <laughs> I wanted to laugh. <laughs> Mission accomplished. Uh, he escorts you through the station to his uh, his quarters, to his uh, office, I should say. And uh, he sits down at his desk. He says, thank you, my friends. I, I owe you a favor of gratitude for retru- not just executing this mission, for which I've paid you handsomely. He pays you the remainder of your... He gives you the... I think he could 500 credits for that each. We need to negotiate better. And then... Check. Yeah, whatever it was. And then also for your discretion in retrieving my package, <clears throat> not opening it. Oh. Here's another... I think he had quoted six and you guys negotiated Four. seven or eight. I think we did a piece, right? I don't think that was ever clarified. <laughs> we can go back and check, but whatever you think is fit, we'll just go with whatever you... Let, let, let's split the difference, call it 200 each. I'm good with that. I don't know how that splits the difference, but okay. Well, it, okay, it's, it, it's, it's eight. Plus yeah. four balls. It's fine. What was the original terms? It you was 600. A person for the I think bonus. it was 600, period. Oh, 600, period. Uh, all right, then whatever your you discretion, said. Your discretion for not opening and investigating it is appreciated. You did not keep your end of the bargain, Mr. Skeleton. I have paid you for the services you rendered to me. You gave us a sheep to put our things in, and then the sheep disappeared, and we were trapped on the surface. We could have finished our mission intact. Look, look, I have a cut right here. Look, look at him. You have a beautiful starship that you got for nothing as a reward. That is not from you. Therefore, you, cannot you would not have that starship that. without me. You do not get credibility for that. Oh, look, I am breathing today. Thank you so much. No, you did as alter for, the terms of the deal. As for your cargo. Trigger, to be fair. Or go, oh, ghost. ghost. Ghost, to be fair, he's not breathing today. That is a good point. Nevertheless, you owe us more. We took on additional danger. As... There were undead zombie creatures that tried to attack us. That is what you signed on for. However, he had aliens however, infected in his body. He I, was. I do not pregnant. appreciate being abandoned and stranded on the. However, from. exactly. I did continue to operate in good faith and liquidate everything that was liquidatable on the hippocampus, and he provides you with uh, whatever the the fifteen hundred for the no qual. Yes, no. There was no mark. He got they actually got the actual value of it, not just the you know the ten percent kind of thing. You got the whole. 1,500 of it. What if I wanted that, Noqual? That is very rare. I could have turned that into armor. Now you've turned it into credits. I get credit anywhere. Would you like me to switch it back? Get me extra money now, because I, one day I am going to need to buy that. 
then I will take the money back. And no, he takes, no, no, no. He, no, take, he takes the credit, the credits back, and he reaches into his drawer and he pulls out your. I just want. Which one did you want? I think both no. shall be appropriate. And if you want to continue to maintain our discretion, we now have the entire press of the Absalon station. We could tell them about that curious eight foot long coffin of a box, which possibly contained, I don't know, your girlfriend. Maybe it is your booty. Maybe it is weapons. We don't know, but we can let the press decide what it is. So why not give us both to ensure we remain quiet about this thing? He chuckles a little bit, and he presses a button, and he plays that exact quote you played a few minutes ago about knowing exactly what you've done and who you are. And then he says, credits, or whatever the other thing is. Is that supposed to be a threat? Because they already know. The Academy already knows. So you have nothing on me, but I still have something on you. You have nothing on me. I'm a well-respected ambassador. Pick your choice. Or take nothing. Give us the no-qual and half the credits, and we will be done. Take your choice. I have given you my choice. Then you'll have nothing. And he puts both of the things back in the store. Perhaps we should try a different tactic of negotiation. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take, what was it? Credits or? Or no-qual. He had actually gotten you the, 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 the market value of the no-qual, not the 10%. So it liquidated 100%. Are we going to actually do anything with that no-qual other than sell it? Yes, it is resistant against all forms of magic. Can create a special armor or weapon. So we want the Nequal? We want them both. He abandoned us. We'll take the Nequal, He please. broke the rules. Take the money. Take the money. It's Let's it's go. <laughs> okay, he takes the Nequal back and gives you the money. Oh. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to work with him. Not against <laughs> That wasn't who was saying that. That was me telling you the money is Oh, no, no, no. What I said, I, I thought I, I'm sorry, I apologize. I thought I said the money, though, the credits. <laughs> Do we have any more business to conduct here? No. Thank you. Let's go. <laughs> and another thing. I, I, I drag I, him out by his tail. <laughs> ghost, ghost. Ghost, 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 ghost. These guys, these guys creep me out, ghost. Can we just go, please? I really want to go. These guys really, they really creep me. Like, as if it was nothing, suddenly Ghost loses interest in the, the Oxian ambassador and says, Okay, Trigger, what are we going to eat? Let's go. I believe we Yes, well, let's food. get some food and, yeah, food. Food is good. Chiska communicates with you. It's, real, it's, it's relatively mid-morning and says, um, Once you're settled, come okay. see me in the early afternoon. Okay. So we're going food for it is. the... 800 one time only for the for you said 1500 no 1500 was for the no call okay and then there was 800 the, as a group for the 800 as a group. Okay. we'll call it that and then you got 500 each for undertaking the mission from him i was taking notes why am i writing this down okay got it yeah so so basically everybody got about 700 credits each plus the 1500 i'll double check the math but i think you're spot on man so it's the 800 plus the 1500. There are five of us. Yes. yes. Claire, Claire managed to, Claire waited so you guys all got off the ship. And when the crowd followed you out, she disappeared out the back. Oh, that's right. I looked for Clara at some point and she was gone. Okay, so you guys can jot down. Each person got 900. And I, I, I turned to Ozzy and I'm like, Ozzy, what happened? What did you. She disappeared. How did you, how did you lose. You were supposed to be watching her. Actually, I, I don't know what they did, Ozzy. I don't think that's the last we've seen of her. We'll cross paths again. And if we meet in honorable combat, she will not survive. She's not further in the adventure path, but I will use her again. I was going to say, she doesn't have to be in the adventure path. No, we're, 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 we're off the rails. said 960. We're, we're, we're 960 per player. Everybody got 960 credits. Plus what we had before. Plus what we Plus had before, before. Which for me was zero. I think I had 1,200. I don't think I bought anything. Really. No, you, were, you didn't. Can you, can you supplement my augmentations? <laughs> At an interest rate of 20%. Sure, that sounds good. Break your leg if you don't pay it back within I'm years. sure she'll break my leg. <laughs> <laughs> but, oh, God. <laughs> so I, I assume we want to, like, I want to I wanna go clean up and get something to eat. 
before we go see Chesu, Chiska, whatever. <laughs> Perhaps we before can we go... see the chi before we see the bug person. Trigger, trigger. Perhaps we can go to yes, the ghost, ghost. Fusion Queen. We take twenty percent of their profits for the next two years. Perhaps they can make their first payment to us. It's been three days. Yes. <laughs> two days. But now they've been advertised, and they're that might be better for payments. tomorrow. Let's say they were advertised like twenty. But 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 ghost ghost we. We might, we, 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 we might not have a, a, a lot of profits, but maybe they get some food for us, and we don't have to. I agree, free food. Also, if you're looking to make money, showing our faces would draw more people. Yes. Which, I suppose we yeah. could do that. Dig him out. <laughs> Henry, Henry is passed out of Amy's lap. She's Henry. waving at us with his paw, Mikey. <laughs> oh. Henry is a, is a dog. Poor Henry. Not a human. Just correct people's knowledge there. Okay. Say, so don't tell Henry that. He's a keep. He's a keep. He is our keeper. All right, all right. So you guys, head on down to the Fusion Queen. You, uh, you have your. Actually, do I, I still have the thing if you want to pull it up, but I don't think it's, it's worth doing. Um, they're, they're doing okay business for the, for the lunchtime crowd, I guess. Um. You'll, everybody give me a perception check. No. <laughs> oh, God. Niner. <laughs> Twelve. Twelve? You feel okay? Oh, wow. I actually rolled pretty good. Uh, Nala got a 20. I rolled a 16. I at least got a 20. I at least see and Nala are both fairly certain that there are at least two reporting drones following you, which would not be unsurprising considering you're minor celebrities at this point. I feel as though we should be getting paid for this now. Um, trigger, trigger. Oh no, that's me. Hey, go. Yes, go, trigger. Go. Yes, sir. <laughs> do you? That's only do you? Do you? They look the same from up here, you know. Do you want to shoot those drones? I will. I will distract them, and you come up. Come up. Come up behind them, and and. Sh Whatever you say, trigger. No problem. Hey, uh, just, just a point. You should at least let them follow you to the Fusion Queen so people think you're there and won't go there. I do a trigger set. Okay, we will let them... It doesn't matter. Yeah. We'll, we'll do that. And then on our way out... You'll shoot them? You got yes, we'll shoot them after we, after we have... A... You, are you home, Mikey, or, remote, or somewhere? No, I'm home. Wow, your, your connection is just uh, so, so, so broken. Yeah, so... I'm on my cell phone because my other laptop that runs Discord, uh, shit. I got the blue screen of death on my, on my other issues. laptop. That sucks, man. So, all right, you got Yeah, I'm, I'm really un unhappy about that because I don't have the money to buy another one. You head on down to the Because I just bought a... Oh, sorry. Boat. Just put a boat. <laughs> oh, that's right. That is something you throw money at. All right, it's you, you head on down to the Fusion mm -hmm. Queen. Um, there's already people there, clearly, from your announcement. Um, it's a pretty happening place. They clear a table for you right away. They keep a, a level 21 gang. Oh, yeah. Was it the right one? Yeah. Is it the right one? Level 21 were our allies. Yes, level 21 gang is, is running the show. They make sure that you're only moderately bothered. Um, we check in. Jarbaxa and... comes up. Oh, Jarbaxa's there. He makes it, well, he, once he hears you there, he, he shows up about 10 minutes after you get there. He, uh, my friends, it is good to see you that you have survived such harrowing experiences. Ghost grins and responds back in a traditional Yosoki answer and speaks very kindly to him and jokes around with him. I have uh, somebody here who would like to talk to you, though. And he introduces uh, another oh, Yosoki. Oh, okay. Another Yosoki you don't know. Uh, this is my friend. His name is... Well, his name is not important. His name is what? Chewy. No. His Chavo. Name, his name is not important. But he, ha, he, he has something for you. And... Uh, his name is Spider. That's uh, another good Evolution. Name. <laughs> Shooting star. No. <laughs> Matador. My, Matador. My, <laughs> my name is Diamond. And I have something for my two friends. And she takes out... I, I, I get my guns ready. <laughs> oh, we met Diamond already. Right, okay. but, but it doesn't, right, doesn't look like Diamond. Oh. And uh, Diamond provides two, um, two, I forget what they're called. I have to look it up again. It suits to disguise you. 
Oh, they're oh, damaged. Okay. okay. Um, and they, they, they can only they can only assume one. You, they're they're stuck in the Yusoki size, and they can only assume the Yusoki that previously wore them. It's like a broken so, chameleon circuit. So it's it's perfect for you and, and, and Trigger. It does not have a lot of value to, to Diamond. She's thanking you for your advertisement and giving you something that provides you a camouflaged hidden. Um, there is a, there is an actual item for this. I forget what it's called. We'll look it up. We'll call it hollow suit. Or something. Oh, that's cool. Okay. So you guys can. You, oh, you, Diamond, you, thank you. It, you can't fix it. You can't change it. It only changes to one other Yusoki form. Do you have anything bigger? Yes, but you will have to pay full price. Um, how much is full price? <coughs> Come on down and we'll talk about it. Can I get an advance? <laughs> the vest always with the money and never having it. It is tough. He gets addicted to things like alcohol oh, no. and killing people, and then he has no. You're thinking. <coughs> oh, I am. But okay. he gave Uncle Jeff his death hand. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thanks, Amy. See you in the morning. Good night, Amy. Good night. Sleep well. Bye, Amy. Travels. Thanks. Good night, Mikey. Good night, Amy. Good night, Adam. Good night. Good night. So you guys uh, get your fill as you're wandering out. You uh, you take a <laughs> drunk call. Uh, you take a wrong turn, end up in an alley that you're not familiar with. I hate when that happens. We should have taken a left at Albuquerque. I believe you are actually right for once. Mm. No left. No left. <laughs> we take the left. No, no, you are right. No, no, we take a left. Okay. You, Who? you big ox. We go to the left. What? You could you take your hand and you hold it up like this. And do you see the letter L in Federation? That is loser. That is le- no. That you're holding it the wrong way now. That I is- don't know. <sighs> T- tell me. Tell me tomorrow. What is your survival role? Come on now. You've got this. Should my survival? I think it's the one thing I've trained. Oh. <laughs> okay. I have one level of survival. Oh. <laughs> I'm splitting between that and intimidate. That sounds reasonable. Yeah. yeah. With all of my three. Skill, skill points. But I'm athletic as a mother lover. <laughs> what is your athleticism? Like? Ten. Oof. I can do push-ups like nobody's business. <laughs> Stop making fun of Jeff. We can't. As you uh, end up rounding the corner. As you can see, I'm basing my character on myself. <laughs> Guys, that's not the truth. <laughs> as, you, as you round the corner in the alley... A person that you don't recognize uh, steps out in front of you, and uh, they're harmed with a, with a heavy. They're down to the very bottom. I'm going to center you. Hold on a second, Bob. They are armed with a heavy um, automatic weapon. Nice math. And uh, three like math. three security <laughs> robots that? step behind you, and three security robots are with him. Mm. And he looks at a ghost and trigger, and he says. Akaton sends his regards. And we're initiative. <laughs> you know what, Pinky? You get one more shot and then you're retired for the night. Natural 20. 24. Six for... Oh, ho, hey, Bob. I was about to say Ekarat. Natural 20? Yeah. Oh Nicely God. done, man. Uh, the avatars have... Oh, there they are. That's good, because I haven't rolled higher than, like, a 14. So what was your final tally? Oh, come on. Why are there two of them? 25. Oh, there's Whoa. three of everybody. Damn it. Bet. Uh, no? No. Nine? Ozzy? Ozzy got, uh... Six. Six? I at least he got 23. Oh, Did you get her improved in it? Yeah. You get I my improved in it too. I didn't get improved in it. Hopefully this should help. The, I've plugged in all the numbers for the ones that have. Yes. Where did I, oh, I have it in my thing over here. There's still one extra yeah, actually, trigger. You know, I'm, I'm not going to go with you anymore, Pinky. You're done. Oh, You're done. For the night? Or for, for the night. Oh, boy. I, I've rolled the, 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 the red die twice, and it's come up you know, be, uh, over 15 both times. Ooh. Hopefully it's not just for Ilyasi. All right, so this guy. I don't know what I got. I can't do it yet. I promised five. you I'd give you one more shot. Oh, 10 for the security robots. And for the bug. 
Well, I already beat that. Eleven. Uh, where is it? Plus two. And it plus two. Hmm. Really, a monkey gets better than that. Really? My it's plus two. <laughs> exactly. Case in point. No, I just. A lizard, not a monkey. God. A gorilla lizard. All right. And gorilla like. Descending. All right. Is that viewable where everybody? Don't know yet. Still don't know yet. What are we looking at? The map? Yes. Yeah. All right, so there's there's some rooms here uh, to your north. This area here is accessible. Okay. These rooms are all closed off, but you can get in that center four or six squares to get some cover. Um, to your south, those are rooms that you can try to break into. Does it go? How tall are the ceilings? And yeah. can you can you climb over these structures? Or it's a these are, it's, this, it's basically an alleyway. Okay. So no, it's a ceiling. It's a, it's a space station. It's a 12 foot ceiling. 10 foot ceiling? 10 foot ceiling. Um, oh, let me give these guys some uh, colors so we can uh, kind of rate them a little better. Red. Actually, we'll save red. I like the colorization thing. That's helpful. It is it's very helpful, I find. Because <laughs> even on my notes here, I, I can then give them a color that I can follow. The heck is that? So, Bob, that arc emitter... Do you remember, what was that? Wake up, Jeff. Um, checking now. I'm just, I'm just trying to find the damage. Uh, got it. Or is that the one that's just? Oh, it's nice. It's a blast, a 15 foot blast. It does like a cone of damage. The damage is a 1d4 energy, 20 charges, and it does a blast. Um, okay. A 15 foot like cone blast. It uh, discharges a cone of electrical energy that can damage and stun anyone within the area. Um, and. Alright, so let's go. Trigger. That's it. That's All a right. cone, So Trigger is going to turn around. Oh, well, I. Turn right? Around. So there's three. There's three guys behind me. Yeah, three guys behind and three guys in front. You could possibly, with your arc emitter, you might be able to target all four of those guys uh, to your left on the hallway if you step forward like one square. Yep, that's exactly what we're gonna do. Next to Ayalisi, and we're gonna target uh, the guy right in the middle, the green dot. Sure. I also have another maneuver. Uh, with the arc emitter. So, um, this, is, this is in relation to your guys' background, you know. Mm -hmm. the, 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 what the, was the, that, Jack? When the, when the guy was speaking, he said Akaton sends his regards. It was to Ghost and Trigger. Mm -hmm. I don't think my roles are supposed All right, to be so... risky. <laughs> Got pennies. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. 20. To hit, job. Hold on a second. I'm, I'm setting up my, my sheets here. <laughs> okay, that's fine. No worry. Take your time. How does that thing work now? It's going to hit all of them in a blast. So, arc emitter, it's, it's going to hit everybody in a fit. It's a blast. They take 1d4. Uh, blast weapons don't extend beyond their first range radius, so it only goes up to 15 feet, and that's it. But everybody's in the radius. For every attack you make with a weapon with the blast, roll one attack against each target in the cone, starting with those closest to you. Every attack takes a minus two penalty, um, so you do have to subtract two from their... So you have to roll four times, but and every one is a minus two to your final... After you sum up all your other bonuses. And then when you roll damage, you only okay. roll it once for all targets. Okay. So the first guy was a 20. That's it. The next guy. Did you get any critical hits? Uh, it, uh, 12, 13, 14, so 17. 
Are you talking to EAC or KAC? Um, electrical, EAC. It's electrical, so EAC. I can't hear you at all, Mikey. You kind of cut out on us, Mike. We got number one and number two was a 14. What about number three? Uh, number three was a seven. 17 is a hit as well. And now you're hitting the other guy? Uh, uh, the natural 20. Good things happen when you roll a natural 20. Uh, if you roll one or more critical hits, roll the extra critical damage only once and apply it to every creature against which you score a critical hit. Uh, you can't avoid shooting all at allies in the cone, nor can you shoot any creature more than once. All right, so you hit everything and you get, you get double damage against the guy. Right. Okay. So 2d4. So 4, 5, 6, 7, plus 1 is 8 damage. I guess the eight is only to the guy, right? Because that'd be the double deck. Yep, but you also... And then the other three... What's that? Uh, you have the stun property on the arc emitter when you hit with a uh, critical. So I'm looking up what the stun thing does. If somebody else can find it for me. But I bet you it does something bad to uh. them. I'm going to guess it stuns them. <laughs> Ooh, that's crazy. That thing sounds awfully overpowered. <laughs> I did one four damage with a minus two to hit, though. And very limited range. You have to be within 15 feet. Uh, excuse me. But in the hands of Trigger, yes. All right, so you use electrical damage? Yes. That yeah. to do to the robots? The security bots? Yeah. Uh, when you get stun, uh, oh, that's stun mode. Critical hit effects, stunned, target is stunned for one round. Yeah, stunning I have right here. What does stun do? Stun means you are unable to act at all. You drop everything you are holding, you can't take actions, you are flat-footed. So oh, he dropped his weapon. Dropped his weapon? He had a shoulder strap, but yeah, just dropped it to the... To and strap. he's flat-footed, which means it's easier to hit him. Okay, what are the images of the robots? Uh, four points of damage to the robot, eight Nothing points of damage to the guy. The robot seemed to be it, it hurt more than you expected from your shot. Mm. Funny, the robots have a vulnerability to electrical damage. Who would have thought it? The robots are not stunned. The they are immune to stun. Okay, well, they weren't stunned anyway. Yeah. All right, um, Ghost. Do you uh, have your, uh, your, your dragon breath, uh, sorry, your dragon gland information in front of you? Oh, my God, I forgot about the dragon glands that's the way to go 3d6 3d6 yeah uh is it safe for half i just gotta yeah uh, yes. yes okay well then 3d6 10 plus half your level plus your con modifier is what kind safe. of what kind do you have electrical right electrical I, I don't know what it was no no it was electrical really mm -hmm. i know i'm fire uh, are you firing the one the three in the front or three behind you the ones that were hit the ones that were already hit all right, you you have to move to so not hit Ielisi. Agree. So he's moving forward one, and that should be enough. I think so. What's the distance on it? Uh, do you have it in front of you? I do. I just gotta find it on the page again. I think it's fifteen feet. So wait, Jeff, he's next. Fifteen foot cone. You're up next, buddy. Uh, I rolled maximum damage. Three sixes. All right. So the what's the DC to resist? It's. Uh, 10 plus half your level plus your con modifier. 10 plus half your level. So my yeah. con meter is plus 1. So 12. Mm -hmm. Alright, first guy rolls a natural 2. Second guy rolls a 5. Second. Jesus. <laughs> you have one more. You got the, oh, the, the, dude. the dude. stun guy. But what does stun He's do? fine. He's got 19. Does stun do anything for... 19, it doesn't matter. Yeah. Alright, so the... Um, it's half damage. Half damage of 18. For... Nine. For, the, for yeah. the for the actual guy. Stunned guy gets nine. Everybody yeah. else gets eighteen. Uh, yes. Electrical. Yes. Oh, oh, electrical. Eighteen. I'm doing the math. <laughs> I totally forgot I had electric breath. I, I was really didn't know. I was just bolt bust and balls. If that doubles damage, that's like thirty six points of damage to each one of those. Creatures. It does. It doesn't double, but it does increase more than normal. Okay. 
Uh, and he drops prone. Hopefully not him run up and start punching you. Oh, uh, mm. hmm. Hmm. I guess I'll stand. That's a good point. Well, I guess the question is: Do, do you see any? Do you see any weapons on the, on the bots? Do they have pistols? The bots. The, well, you. They have something attached to their arm. You don't know what it is. Does it look like it's a, a pew pew or is it a bash bash? Uh, the robot itself is a bash bash. Okay. <laughs> so, I've never run a follow of security robots before. I'm unfamiliar with their weapons and tactics. One more question. Does it say whether you can spend a resolve point to use it again in in combat? I don't think it first You level. can't use it again until you've rested for 10 minutes, okay. though you can spend one resolve point at any point to recharge it immediately. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, so yeah. abusive. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, Ilyse is up. Uh, okay. Ilyse is going to shoot at... Uh, she would use her magic missile. She would use her magic missile on the guy in the back. Yeah. And that would be four. Which does not go three, pew, pew pew. Three? How three. does it get to be four? It never goes to four as far as I've read. Okay. Which is stupid. It should, it should advance with age, with age, but it doesn't. With level, I mean. I, I thought it was like it wants, like if you target one, you get an extra something like that. If you that. don't move, you get an extra die. And that gets it to three. Yes. Okay, she's not moving. So she's going to three D4. So four or five, seven damage. <clears throat> oh, he's taking a bunch of damage so far. Yes, I was gonna just. That's good. So he's stunned. So he can't do anything. Did yep. he save for so stunned? He's just, just stunned for one round. Okay. So then he's back next round. <clears throat> okay. So. Um, Unless I stun him again. Ha ha. <laughs> All righty. This guy steps up to even the uh, to make him not in the line, and he fires. His his arm comes up, and an electrical charge discharges from his arm. It's a jolting arc that hits all five of you. Oh, fight fire with fire. Yes, I mean in, you know he. It, it, yeah, what we do is overpower. Yeah, I'm not doing 18 points of damage. Though. I'm gonna do 1d8, <laughs> and you're gonna get to save for half. Well, he's gonna do 3d8 if the other two hit. Well, it's <laughs> actually all six. Mm, 68. So give me a you're gonna have to save for each one. Okay. A reflex save. Or okay, that that, that 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 could protect even at half damage for us. I mean, most of us have like 20, 25 hit points. So this just. I have twenty twenty five. Okay. The part the arc jits out. It hits all of you. It's like a freaking Star Trek episode. No, it's like Emperor Palpatine. Is this an area attack? Uh, mm, it shoots an arc of electricity. So I don't think it's an area yeah, attack. Okay. I think it jumps more of a static, like a lightning ball. Got it. All right, so the damage is seven. So if you save, you, you take three. If you fail, you take seven. What's yep. the DC? 13. All right, ILEC and uh, Ozzy both save. Ghost just barely... Okay. Oh, sorry, we took three? Yes. Ghost gets his 14. He just barely... Okay, we're going to repeat this five more times. Trigger... Oh, I'm sorry. 18. Trigger does not save. What was the damage total? Okay. Seven. Seven or three. Seven on a fail, three okay. on a success. Okay. Three, Trigger six, takes seven. Six. He did not. He did not. Okay, so that was blue. Green is up. Damage is six or three. Make your saves. Uh, so I only see this. Okay. Trigger saves Trigger that one. Ghost saved. So one. three. Okay, let's see. Total of ten. Reflex. Thirteen. Reflex. Three thirteen reflex. Next one. Everybody ready? Yep. I just want to say, I'm not going to do 18, 18 points of damage, but I'm going to do 18 points of damage. Actually, you guys are destroying this encounter far worse than yeah. I ever imagined you could. Well, I think we just blew our wad. Two. So you take a one two. or two. Eight. No, because he's going to keep recharging it. <laughs> Ghost fails. He takes the full two points of damage. What was it? One. Two, what was the middle one? How much damage did I Three or I six. Say. Three or six. Are you, what do you mean the middle one? You, a, you, you this is the third one I just rolled. Yeah. yeah. On attack number two. It was, was three or six. Three or six. Yeah, right. Attack number one was also three or six? Three I, or seven. Three or seven. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And this one is one on or two. On that one, Ozzy failed, but I at least he made the save. So hang on. Before we continue, what are you at for stamina? Ghost has 13 stamina left. Uh, Ozzy has 16. I at least he has five. Okay. How you five. doing? 
oh, this is not good because then you're down to like tr tr ones. Tr Trigger has 11 stamina left. Okay. The the rear ones advance. Uh, they have to get a little closer because they only have a range of 40 feet. Mm. 30 feet, whatever it is. Different squares. If they're going to do a range attack, I can make an opportunity attack against one of them. <laughs> that is your choice. Only one of them. That is your choice. You, you could have done it anyway, even if they had an advance, because you have a range of, you have a reach of two anyway, right? That's true. So, um, purple will go. I'm going to opportunity another, attack on the purple. Another two. Yeah, kill him. That's going to hit with a nat 19. I think so. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, 20. One or two. 20. Take one. Two. Wait, oh. One on a fail? Yeah. Go fail that one. Oh, max damage. 13. 13. Nice. What what if you succeed? If, if you take one on a fail, do you take nothing on a save? You take you take I'm sorry, you take one on a save and two on a fail. That's a oh, okay, save. I got it. Sorry. So one. I at least see. Fails takes two. Alright. Pinky goes, he rolls a seven. So it's three or seven. <clears throat> That's a save, thank goodness. Two. Ghost is down to nine stamina. How's everyone doing? Are you kidding me? How are we? I'm down to two. I'm safe. <laughs> safe. Reflexes are my, my gem. That's his thing, man. Yeah, it's thing. How about 15 hit points? 15 hit points? You use the your stamina? This is uh, what was the damage on this one, Full? Seven. At least he's down to 11. We're down to one more. Hit points. Well, the good news is that we won't get this every round. I should recharge everyone. <laughs> and the last one is a five, so it's two or five. Two. No, that, okay. I'm not going to do 18 points of damage. No, you did 24. Did I really? Yes. Nice. And you're still not even hurt. So let's recap. I at least see just took another seven points of damage. Ow, oh, she's hurt. She has five. four hit points. She has four. Five. five. So, the last one was. That's it. Oh. So it two times ago. Yeah. yeah. It's only five. Oh, so she's I hope she's not attached to that character. She has six hit points. Sorry. Ghost is at seven stamina. <coughs> she's got what? Zero. Zero. Uh, Zero. Trigger? Trigger? Trigger has five stamina left from 22. Ilisi is down to how many hit points? Six. And how many is Nala got? Ten. Right. Ten stamina left? No. <laughs> Nala, you are up. Who are you going to heal? I think I have to give. Uh, go with. Uh, Elise? Elise, right? I, I think, think I agree. Wise. I'm going to inspire her. Give us the inspiring words. Use the, use the French language. <laughs> Just send it with Mon Cherry. Mon Dieu. <laughs> that was. What was that? <laughs> my, my God. My God. Uh, they, that regains a number of stamina points. Ooh. Twice your envoy level, plus your charisma modifier. That's 10. Nice. That will help. Yep. 10 stamina? You need to start taking these things out. Uh, let me see. Get up. You can do it. What does she get 10 to? Her stamina? Stamina. Yeah. stamina. Yeah. That's your big help. The envoy cannot heal. You can do it! Actually, you can do it all so night long! A mystic where he could get healing. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, should I get him? Or should I move? Uh, Get him. You can only get one. Who do we want to get? The, the robots on the left are, are beat up bad. Are you on... Um, there's there's, there's there's sparks. There are jerky movements. Attack, right? That was my standard. Standard is to heal. Standard is healing. My move is get him. I at least he has an electrical attack with energy ray. Uh, if you move into the doorway, you get some potential. Well, I don't know. It's there's, it's only safe, so I don't know if moving in a doorway would keep them from hitting you on one side. I mean, yeah, they, they just attack us all anyway. It doesn't matter. You can move up next to one. And... Mikey, what are you doing? <laughs> Woo, that had to hurt. Uh, your call, man. Whatever you think is best. Should we get that? Is anybody hitting the... Oh, uh, Ozzy, as a free action, says, Let's kill one and break through. Let's kill one and break through. Which one did you... Have? Unless we break... These guys are damaged to hell. Just mm -hmm. one of the guys on the end. It doesn't matter which one. Either, either blue or orange. <laughs> 
Du må bare blø. Yes, uh, everyone, focus on the one on the right. Is it Azul? Okay, it goes back uh, to trigger. Azul? Uh, Azul's up, actually. Oh, oh. sorry, Azul. Blue. Azul will crush them. Okay, Ozzy is going to charge the blue one. Can and you charge through your own guys? The one who's, you're going to leave me there with the other three? Oh, you're going to move first. Shut up. I don't know. Hang you're going to get three opportunity attacks? Sorry, try. Wait, you... they, can, they can have range and they can do an opportunity attack? They have a slam. I don't know. You tell me. Why don't you kill that one that you're almost dead with? Because they're over here, the almost dead ones. You just had an opportunity <laughs> I think I'm going to knock off a few. With That's the you, right? Breath again. Yes. Did you just have an opportunity to take one of these where you did 13 points of damage? I, yes. yes. Okay. Yes. yes. But it didn't kill it. Didn't make it close again. Are you not even close to it? It's hurt, but not. Okay. It's hurt. I thought you'd be able to take it out. Well, it wouldn't be a charge. I guess it would be a bull rush is what I would want to do. But yeah. Sorry, I'm trying to do two characters at once here. I will do total defense attack against purple, which is the one that I did the opportunity attack against. Correct. So how does this work again? It's just a minus two? Total? No, not total defense. Fight defensively. Come on, we'll pick you. That ain't going to hit. Oh, it's going to hit. No. <laughs> so it's... Uh, KAC of 16. KAC. <laughs> Hold an eight, and I'm at a minus two. Hmm. Eight and seven is fifteen. Minus two is thirteen. Is there a Look Benny? at that. No fingers. What about a Benny? <laughs> okay. I, I'm going to attack one of six I'm things that's beating the shit out of us. They're not going to matter. Okay. Trigger. Trigger, trigger you're up, man. Trigger. Um, trigger is going to target the green guy in the middle with his arc emitter again. Uh, the blue guy has. Oh, uh, like that plus two wouldn't have mattered. Trigger the blue guy has right, Gethin so on him right now. It's easy, easier to hit. Because I just realized fight defensively makes no difference. Because <laughs> they just hit us no matter what. Okay, I, I mean, I mean, Bob, I have to, I have to roll an attack. Oh, that's true. So. You're hitting all of them. Yep, go for it, man. Sorry. Yeah. Fucking dragon breath. Oh yeah. Yeah, no, options. It's one All right. So the first guy is. Uh, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 20. That's a hit. And mine's fire. The second guy is higher with a 19 bait. Uh, so that is, is a 20. The third guy is a 22. And the fourth guy is a 17. All right, and damages. And the damage is so one D four plus one. Do you want to retcon back that opportunity attack? Uh, five so points of damage. Max it. damage. So it is. So. Uh, five, five, total of five damage for each one, one of them. But it is and, electrical. Yep. All three of the robots seem to um, shut down. They don't fall apart, but they seem to shut down for the moment. Deactivate. You think you can take 3d6 damage? Yeah. You think you want me to do a Cuppies on an Ekarath? Oh, it's that guy. I don't remember what that is. No, Cuppies on an Ekarath is that you attack and miss all the bad guys and crit on me. <laughs> they could happen. I don't think that's a, if, if that's your plan. Yes, we don't want to do that. I can that awesome. Breath. If that's a risk... You're in the way, but I can dragon breath it. What is the range of dragon breath? Uh, 15 feet only. So you're going to get closer? I can get right behind Ek and do uh, Ek. I can get right <laughs> behind Ozzy and do it. One, two, three, four. Oh. Uh, four. I'm just trying to see if I were to stand in the corner and like do it from here. I think that would hit me. From here? Yeah, you would go through a square. I mean, unless like right you wanted there. to get yellow and pink but not purple. Then I can make a case for it, because you're touching the corner, my corner, right? Yeah, I think you're. I think you're getting him regardless. He's just in a bad spot. All right. Well then. No, I'm the thing is, I'm right in the. I'm right where I'm supposed to be. <laughs> a bad spot. Yeah. <laughs> I guess we're gonna risk it. Are you okay with that? Do it. Hey, your big Golov, get out of the way. You're shorter than me. 
Can you run up and breathe and do your breath again mm-hmm. right between my legs? <laughs> do you alone? really want to have him shoot some now with your tail in the way? Oh no, he'd be under my tail. I mean, oh, I'm talking like he'd be like Henry, like. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> I'm only three feet tall. I'll let you save. I'll give you a plus two to reflex save. Okay. Okay. Uh, here comes the. Oh, he spends a resolve point and down to four resolve points. Here's the roll. Nine points of electrical <coughs> damage this time. Okay. And the save is thirteen. The save is thirteen. Save. This is not a. Is this a spell or spell like ability? It's, a, I think it's just an exploit. What's my save here? It's against um fort. Uh, can you check? Uh, do you have the dragonkin section open anymore? Dragon gland? I, th- I should be reflex. It, okay. Doesn't matter. The same shape. What am I saving, Bob? 13 or 15? Yeah, 13. Reflex. 13. I'm, I, all three of them saved. What oh, was the damage? Oh. Uh, it was nine. Nine. So half that, four. Half that plus half, the, half that half. Oh, you said I got a plus two. I gave you a plus two. That, makes, that made the difference. Hey, all right. And what's the half damage on that again? Four. Nine goes down to four. I have to remember, combat doesn't have to be hard to be fun. That's what I have trouble with, struggle with. <laughs> it, it's it's more the complaining more the... and then kicking our ass that, that is frustrating. <laughs> You're not going to die. Oh, that's right, because I have no stamina. 23. That was worth it. All right. Ghost, trigger, ghost, Ilesi. Okay. I guess if we're going to stand and fight, Ilesi is going to do... What's it called? Electrical charge there, energy blast. Yeah, her energy ray, and she's going to coincidentally uh, make it electricity. And she's going to target purple. Purple, purple. Dark purple. So she has to make a ranged attack. I failed my save. Natural no, it's not. A, it's just an attack. Yeah, but, but I'm sure it's it not a save for half. No. doesn't matter. We'll do. Uh, where's her ranged attack? Plus three. 18 plus three. So 21 is a, a hit. And it's 1d3. Electrical. Three. Wow. That actually becomes four. Hmm. It's, 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 it's 50% it's, it's, more. It's what percent more? 50% more. Ooh, okay, yeah. So 18 points of damage. Turns that into like 27. Yeah, you, you crushed them. You absolutely crushed them. I was, I, I was frustrated with that. That's crazy. Uh, now we go to the guy who's no longer stunned. The guy who is no longer stunned. But his weapon is on the ground. Well, it's... Yeah. His weapon is not in his hands. Hmm. He... Hmm. Bye, Mikey. Hi, Mikey. <laughs> he breaches hey, into can his. Hey, you guys hear me? Okay. Now we hear you. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, we can now. All right. Good. I managed to. So, sorry, I've been multitasking, and I managed to get my other laptop working again. Oh, good. Oh, hey, good. that's great, man. No, we're up for the night. <laughs> I, I, I know, but at least, yeah, okay. Okay. He he reaches into his pocket and pulls out. You, you, you think it's maybe a grenade? You're not exactly sure. A what? I'm sorry. It, it looks like it might be a grenade. It looks similar to a grenade. And um, he, dr- he throws it on the floor. It explodes. And it actually recharges the three robots in front of him. Not fully. Hmm. And then he runs. Wait, 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 a minute. wait a minute. He's stunned. He can't do anything. He was stunned it's, last turn. It's back to his turn now. He's cleared. No, no. I stunned him again I, on, my, on this turn. Oh, no, you didn't crit him. Did you roll a crit? A natural 20? Is that the only way you could stop? No, I thought, I thought this was what this weapon did. No. no, no, no. Just, it's only a stun on crit. That's, that's the oh, special oh, crit. Oh, my, my bad. Sorry, then. Yeah. You rolled amazingly well. Yes. So the, the um, robots, which were deactivated, all stand up. You can tell they're not, they're not even close to fully functioning. It's more of a temporary charge to let, allow him to escape. Um, so he takes off. What's his move speed? His move is 20. So he's got him one, two, three, four. Each square is, right? You're going after him. You're faster than him. I'm faster than him by far. I'm definitely going after him. <laughs> All the robots are ready, though. You have to get through the robots, too. How big are they? Regular, normal size? Uh, they are medium constructs. Not a problem. Anything with a size larger? Yasoki get a plus five. Are too medium? I'm small. 
Are you really? Yeah. Anything that is a size larger, you so get a plus five to acrobatics to get by without getting an attack of opportunity. So before the robots can act, and actually I should, it doesn't matter, a, a group of Vesk comes storming out and charge the robots. There's about eight or ten of them. Mm-hmm. Um, and they are, they're, they're screaming, for Ozymodius! Or whatever. What should, I, Ozymandias? I, or, or are they o- calling me Anklerus? For Anklerus, your true name. Oh. And they, they swarm the robots. It, it's all chaos. And trying to get that guy might be, hard, be harder than you expect because there's just... Now there's 25 bodies in the hallway. That doesn't matter. I'm very dexterous. I'm going to race after them. I'm going to use Jet Dash. Uh, because now I'm level 3, my speed has increased. Let me have a recurring villain. You know what? He could have a brother. <laughs> Who and wants to avenge him? He could have a good twin. But my One, of the, okay. One of the best drags him back with him for you. Wonderful. I was going to say, or just in the confusion, he got away. You have no idea where he went. No, Bob wants to kill him. I'm going to let Bob kill him. I'm going to let Bob torture him. Okay. Does he still have his thumbs? <laughs> we'll find out in a few minutes. Get that one! Hey, you lizard man! Stop him! He's the leader! Get so, him. so one of them, one of them, as you turn, <coughs> they're, they're coming in. You start to recognize what's happening, and the guys, you say that, and the guys are like, he actually wicks out his tail and clotheslines oh, the guy. Yes. Why can't I use my tail as a weapon? <laughs> Because you didn't even have access to it. You do, not, you do not have the feet. Oh, you know you what? Did not because because you, see, you see this this box that you work in? Yeah. <laughs> also, if I were. How much, is that, how much damage does a tail sword Adam, Adam, you're not on the same set of tracks. The tail sword. The tail blade, or whatever it is. Oh, he's got the tail blade. No, it is not. No, he just, it, that's his action. He just, it's a trip. It's basically a trip action. I'm just making it sound cooler. I know. It is way cool. I love it. I'm just. Now, how can I use this, how can I use this knowledge to work for me? <laughs> so, the. the Vesk make quick work of the robots with your guys' assistance. The the human um, his weapon is 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 uh, weapon is, is there. He's, he's he has nothing on his hands anymore. We search him. I take the binders that we used on Clara two four seven, and we apply those binders Wait. to his hands instead. Are those the same binders we used on Clara two four seven? They are the same binders. How did we get them back? <laughs> I found them on the ground. It was incredible luck. That's mm. a, that whole crowd you happen to find the binders that she left? I like my binders. That These is, are lucky binders. <laughs> She's, that is utterly amazing. I'm I am in shock. Are they for your girlfriends? <laughs> <laughs> oh, ask Clara247. Oh, 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 like I said, for Clara, t- she's open 24 7. It's 24 9. Oh, God. I search oh, 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 God. <laughs> Give that man a Benny. We, we <laughs> he's got a max amount. You guys aren't using him at all. Yeah. This game doesn't require them very much, apparently. No, it will. It can, things can kill us. Uh, so we search them. Bob, this is a, like a CR7 encounter. These are all CR3 creatures. We rolled lucky. Ooh. You guys made mincemeat of them. Triple sixes. Uh, <laughs> he had an area attack of electricity that rolled a stun on the big... And it was, a, well, it, it was damage in a half. Yeah. That, was, that was the good kicker for me. We were quite lucky. So, But it's okay. I wanted, the encounter, I wanted you guys to lose the encounter, but I'll just make it work my way anyway. That's fine. Uh, um, what's on his body? Wait, in his Are, body? Not yet. Sorry, I was just... sorry. That we, we cannot kill him in cold blood. Here. That would be... So uh, he, he has a... Uh, all these people around you would think that would be dishonorable. <laughs> <laughs> um, survival knife, and he's got a, a couple of azimuth laser pistols. A couple of them. And, and Indiana, about, you said he had a big cannon hanging off his shoulder. Oh, yeah, he has the same... I'm sorry, he had the same cannon you have. Oh, that would be an uh, azimuth artillery laser. Yes, he has an azimuth artillery laser and an um, azimuth laser pistol in his holster and a survival knife. And uh, credit sticks, um, identification, no ID, personal com credit, unit, credit card with um, credit stick with two hundred credits on it. it you, you can tell this guy's a, this hired thug. His stuff's probably hidden away somewhere else. So Akitan wanted me to say hello. Hmm. I want to say hello to Akitan. Where is Akitan? Is Akitan your little friend? He could be. He didn't say anything. I spend a resolve point. I get my electricity back. You do not like the shock, do you? Puts a hand on his shoulder. Uh, it says in the power that you cannot be harmed by your own breath weapon. So he breathes on his arm, the electricity traversing down his hand. Actually, he probably puts his hand <coughs> right around his uh, groin area because that's about as high up <laughs> as he's hey. 
and then sends electricity, 3d6 electricity, into this guy's balls. Non lethal. <laughs> I don't know that you can do non lethal to the balls. <laughs> <laughs> um, don't worry, I'm not killing him. <laughs> you might as well be. <laughs> um, give me an intimidate check. And I'm gonna give you a plus five for your actions. In the army of Vesk lying around. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, twenty-two. Thirty-four. What was your question to him? Where is Akatosh? He's home. He hired me to come take care of you. Once he saw you on the infosphere, he sent me here to take care of things, get his revenge for all the stuff you stole from him. How much did he pay you? Not enough, apparently. Not enough, indeed. You are coming with us. To where? <laughs> you are wish you would not be there. Why is it that you like to carry people who are trying to kill us around with us? I don't understand this. It is better to have your enemies in shackles with their genitals electrified than to have your enemies far away with not in shackles and not genitals electrified. <laughs> It is catchy, no? It is a very catchy phrase. It's a horrible phrase. I made that up. I can tell. <laughs> that is my own creation. You could have that one. Let us take him back to the ship and put him in the brig. That's pretty far. Who are your friends here? You, 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 you're, you're talking about dragging him like multiple levels across the station. At some point, security may get involved and you're dragging your body around. That's fine. He's not dead. He's just walking. <laughs> Uh, thank you, my friends. I don't believe I know any of you. What do I owe this uh, honor of your helping me to? Aglarius, you're, you're, the, le the, the legend of, of what you've done has become almost folklore. Disobeying an order to hurt somebody lesser than you. Oh, wait, wait a minute, I need to get my best voice on. Yeah. yeah. You can Disobey, you. avoid an order. That's good. Except you I have no voice you, left. You, you're a female best. <laughs> they are tough too. Anything I will talk to you for now, but next time I do Anything a male vest can do, a female vest can do. Better. <laughs> yes. How do you tell the difference between the male and the female vest? I don't understand. Just look at her. How can you not tell? No, it's a, it's, it's a guy. That is a female. <laughs> You're, it is that a, one, no, no, that one. What, what you have done has already almost become legend. I, the, the finding the secret of the drift rock? I don't understand. No, no, before that, what, what led you here? Disobeying the order to, to hurt the, the, the weak. There, there are those of us who believe that is the right way. The strong should lead by example and not by force. Wait, can you well, tell it? What is it that the lizard man did? Well, it is up to him to tell you. It is not our place to, to, to tell you. Well, you were just telling us just now. No, you, you were over. You were eavesdropping. Oh, oh. <laughs> see. I just want to get the name of the... Uh, when I was... <clears throat> I was contracted to uh, the big biotech firm in the area on a, a grow station around the sun, and we found some... Um, uh, 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 Squatters. They, well, they were squatting. The, the people who were going to worship the sun, I forget, the sun cult, people who were trying to join the sun cult, they were squatting in the grow station. Solarians? Solari no. No. That's a class. It's a, it's a it's class. A, that's a class. Oh. I forget. Orders came from above that, you know, we were as we were clearing them out and brought them to the docking bay, orders came from above to annihilate them and toss their bodies out the airlock. Uh, I was in charge of the unit, and instead of following these orders, I turned and slaughtered the little officer who gave these orders. It was rather shameful. I uh, would not have carried out those orders, but I did not need to slaughter the man who, who, get, who gave them wrongly. Um, That's not what we heard. The berating he gave you and the insults, he deserved everything he got. It's clear these are younger vests. They kind of idolized who and what Osmodi is. They have very... Um, Elevated opinion of you know, yeah. my 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 name I was born with is Anklerus Hugh, but after that moment I was rechristened, rebranded, whatever, as Ozymandias. I can see it is a much better name. Mm. <laughs> Your first name was really pretty bad. Yes, because Ozymandias is much easier to say. Yes. It is cool. Yes, but I, I I ran and that's when it was on my as my as I was fleeing trying to find a new home. I thought I would be out of the the Viscarium forever. As when I ran into you. Guys on the ship on the way to um, the the Starfind Starfinder Society. What are they called? Mm -hmm. Starfinder Society. Yeah, Starfinder Society. But what is that group you are looking for? The Hell Knights. Yes. I've read the information that Chiskix has given me, and they're not quite what I thought they were. 
But uh, they need I, a leader. What's that? They need a leader. They need a lot of help. I mean, their <laughs> name is the Knights of Hell. I wonder, what did you think they would be? <laughs> nice I, guys. I, I, th- I thought they would be uh, a force of order in the galaxy. I mean, that that's what order and mm-hmm. their uh, order by honor. But apparently they are order by force. Ah. Which is exactly what I was trying to run away from, and I don't wish to join them again. However, the shame of what I did is just too much to bear. There's, there's nothing... There is no shame in what you did. You did the right thing. You saved those people. <sighs> those people should not have been slaughtered, I agree. Oh, and after I was... After I was I saw, they ended up getting slaughtered anyway. <laughs> 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 but it wasn't because of me. Uh, so, if I understand correctly, you were a soldier. You were told to kill somebody. And you said no because... He was a mercenary, I think. It was, it was definitely mercenary. I was, I was hired to the security force. I see, I see. So the problem was that they were not paying you enough to kill them. Is that, <laughs> is that it? That, no, they were unarmed. They were compliant. Easy job. They were, it, was, it was easy to get them off the station. Yes. Easy money. Easy money. Usually what we would do is, you know, strange things would grow and the company would say, we don't want those anymore, annihilate them. Not a problem. They're not sentient beings really mm. you know and then they would attack us and we would attack them back it is combat and people die when we found these acolytes they were not uh they were not combatants they were just they were trying to worship we told them that they were trespassing and they needed to leave mm. and so they were, were they were coming with us we were in the shuttle bay we were about to board a shuttle when the orders came down the orders were unjust and i refused to follow them uh, because it would have been expensive, the ammunition, to mow them down. Be- oh, to remove the bodies would have been <laughs> too much work. <laughs> Is that what he wants? Because it was wrong, Ghost. There's no on- honor in slaughtering civilians. The, how, how much were you getting paid again? <laughs> it was not a lot. It was more Tr- or less Trigger, than Trigger, can you explain this to him? It was less than a no one, though, right? <laughs> go, ghost, go, ghost. Yes, uh, not, 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 not everybody thinks, thinks and, and, and acts the way we do because we were taught by the academy. Some, 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 some creatures in the in in the in in, in the universe they, they they operate on a different code than we do. Huh. And uh, uh, Ozzy is one of those strange creatures. It's very strange. He has lost his entire life now. All he had to do is follow an order. And now he's on the run. No, he's, he's inspired many of us. One, two, three, four, twelve. Twelve people. No, we were but a small group of... of, of, of we, 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 we were closest when we saw the feed and we came. We had to see him. We yeah. had to meet him. And they're fawning all over him like... Almost like a religious leader. This is really uncomfortable for Ozzy. <laughs> you don't really like Ozymandias, then, no? What he stands for, what he's, what he's achieved. That's what we should all strive to do. Do you know he is trying to save up for new armor and weapons, but sadly he does not have enough money to do so. I imagine if some group would be willing to take up his cause and contribute credits he might one day be able to fight on the side of righteousness and justice. I can fight on the side of righteousness and justice just fine with the weapons I have. Thank you for your assistance. But a bigger weapon. Don't you hear that? He, ta- he takes out a book and he writes that down. It, 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 it's, 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 it's like, you know, me, me, uh, you don't need the greatest power to... He's, he's rewriting it too later on. You know, those without the most power can still do the most good with what they have. Kind of stuff. No, not <laughs> all like heroes. Really <laughs> right here. Not all heroes wear capes, after all. Oh, that's very catchy. You see, do they need tails? That does help a lot. <laughs> Ozzy Mandius, they should travel well, with the us. Big, thick, meaty tails, not not those little wispy tails. <laughs> it's not the size of the tail. It is what you do with it. It's who you kill with it. Right. <laughs> right. Exactly. Is he writing that one down? No, he is not. Oh, that is too bad. I, I, I was right not to follow those orders, but I should have protected those, uh, those acolytes 
and I should not have slaughtered a superior officer. That is not the best way. It's clear that the the Vesk are they're, they're atypical to what you're used to. They weren't. It, it, they probably weren't raised raised in the Vesk area. <clears throat> they yeah. had some other outside influence that made them less Vesk in your eyes, but more <sighs> passionate, compassionate. Okay. So they're more they're more chaotic good. Yeah. Or, or maybe, you know, neutral good as opposed to... Yes, there's, to, there's good in there now. As opposed to lawful one way or the other. Yeah. <laughs> there's a lot more gray in the world. Yeah. That's interesting. I, Ozzy doesn't see the world that way. It yeah. could be interesting. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, it could be interesting if he's trying to fight against this whole thing he's that's going to be created. <laughs> I'm going to bring him full circle. <laughs> I mean, every time I turn around, every this is a new twist. I don't know how I want to handle this. I like it, though. I like it. Every time I'm like, maybe I want to twist it this way and then come right back around. Or maybe, no, I want to twist it this way and then come back around. <laughs> so I am thinking that you should share your contact information with the glorious Osmandius in case he has a mission someday that requires your muscle in a sea stance. It would, it would be our greatest honor to, to, to share in his, in his victories Against those of darkness. That's right. <coughs> I don't think we're fighting against the, the darkness. We're just doing what we can to make the world a better place. Well, that's but good. isn't that what fighting against the darkness would be? Should I write that down? Fight against the evil. Yes. yes. That is. Yes. There. See, write that down. Yes. But it's, it, it's a matter of honor, not a matter of good versus evil. But doesn't honor lead to good always? Honor is for its own sake. Yes. It is how we live. But, but it is to, how but to, we fight. It is how we die. Yes, but to be honorable leads you to good intentions. Because honor is, is, is good and noble. Well, with good intentions, what could go wrong? And good <laughs> is stupid. That is, that is true as well. Yeah. Boy, is it. <laughs> oh, oh, there's another quote from Ozzy uh, that we've learned. Uh, wisdom passed from the ages down to me. Uh, he's the quote of, uh, hey, guys... Which way is starboard on the ship? <laughs> that, that was it. That, that was it. No, no, I think he is speaking to the direction you choose in life. Is the way that you choose your own path. I see, what, I see, I see. You see now? I see. Yes. Yes. I never said that. It's so humble, so modest. Clearly. Look at him. Clearly. I know. Look, he is shaking. He is so modest. <laughs> oh my oh, god! Did I... <laughs> so, so my attendants are turning into a paladin where they want to be. Not. <laughs> no, I love it. I love it. Did I did I mention that Ozymandias offers one-on-one -on -one special sessions, uh, inspirational sessions, uh, ninety minutes only. He calls it uh, all ninety X and. You couldn't do anything for 90 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> he has a series of instructional videos he can share with you for a small price. Oh, unfortunately. We used all of our money to get here as fast as we could because we saw that he was here. We never thought we'd get the opportunity to see him again. That is no problem. You go get jobs and then you can pay him in monthly installments. And, <clears throat> and then what you do if you want to work for your money or do you want your money to work for you oh that's good because you can go get five if each of you how many of you are, are you here Nine? it's like a dozen of them a dozen? each of you goes and gets a dozen friends and then their money works for you and then when they get a dozen friends you get even more of a cut <laughs> he's, he's looking at you like oh that didn't actually no no no, no, no okay, <laughs> okay. Yeah. I'm not trying to build a money business. money is not the honorable way no, I will help you look here let me take your I, pen I, I, I Tell me more. Here's a pyramid. Here's no, a triangle. No, 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 no. See, that's it. Okay, you go, you go climb your pyramid. Okay. <laughs> I, I thank you for your help in this matter. Surely you saved all of our lives. Don't call me Shirley. <laughs> uh, you know, I, I appreciate your help, and if you, you would like, you may cause, call me Ozzy. It's kind of, it is kind of a big deal in the desk. It is better than Uncle, I would he, say. He, he takes a choked up deep breath. <gasps> All of you may call me Ozzy. I call you, consider you all my friends for coming to my aid. You should be friends with him on Facebook as well. Yeah. <laughs> Facebook's been replaced by Infosphere book. 
Actually, yeah, I, I need to find a better way than, but okay. <laughs> it, 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 oh. Will you be here long? Can we see you again? Uh, it is unknown. We are about to report back to Chiskix mm-hmm. at the Starfinder Academy. And uh, well, I yes. assume we'll get a new assignment. Are, are, are the Starfinders a noble, honorable cause? Uh, they have an honor of their own, I believe. They're they're interested in knowledge, which is not an ignoble pursuit. <coughs> they are very oh, unsupportive. The pursuit though. of knowledge. No support whatsoever. <laughs> Nothing. Tell us to do things they never support us. Nothing. Actually, I read that they give access to all the facilities. They put they house you, they give you food, and they give you medical treatment if necessary. Yeah, no money, though. There's no money. In what, it. what is it with you and money? Money is the root of all evil. As you just said, that money is not important. But it's... one must live. Money, money has importance. It's just cool. See, it's not always the, mo- the most important thing. Yes, yes, clearly. One needs a place to lay their head and their tail. <laughs> and armaments and weaponry. One must Ar- protect armor and one. armaments. One must protect oneself. One has to get to where one is going. Oh, this is more. <laughs> how how old are you? <laughs> <laughs> Always wear sunscreen. That's a good one too. I don't know if we burn. <laughs> these lizards, lizards, lizards don't burn. Look, thank you. I'm not worthy of your honor you know, and your praise. I'm, I'm, I'm glad to have inspired you, but you think you can learn more from the leader, the 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 Vesk elders, as well as you know the small example I have provided, and not a very good one. I don't think so. We will continue to moderate, and we will compare your 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 speeches to what the Vesk elders have to say. Go, go, uh, go with honor. Go, go, <laughs> go with honor. Remember, honor above all. Oh, honor above all. That's been the Vesk saying for like three millennia. For well, since we could remember, which is about five, three hundred years. It isn't. What is, it, it, gap, is it written since up? Since the gap. No, I'm making it up. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yes, it is. It is how you said it, though. It is not what you said. Yes, it's how you said it. Honor above all. Yes. Oh, You're not helping, Ghost. What? I'm helping. <laughs> <laughs> Go, be honorable, find your way in the galaxy. Oh, find your way. That's excellent. Small monthly installment payments. You make them out to G-H-O-S-T. Yes. Uh, so we move on. <laughs> <laughs> they, they give you some kind of information. Yes. Um, I, they say, I try to get away without giving them mine. <laughs> We, we, we know I won't dishonor them, but... We, we, we know that you have a, a part ownership in the Fusion Queen, so if we ever really, 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 really need you, we'll leave a note there. That sounds like a good idea. I like that. Thank yes. you. All right. Thank you. And good luck with everything. I, ho- I hope our paths cross again. Same to you, my friends. Thank you. Well done. That was good. Ozzy walks away shaking his head. They were all best. A dozen of them. A dozen of them. A dozen apostles. What? The apostles of Ozzy Mendes. I need to find. Peter. I need to come up with a good name for the Church of Ozzy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I believe the Church of Ozzy is just called metal. <laughs> we call the Church of Osborne here. <laughs> hey, uh, Trigger. Trigger. Yes. Do you think you could reprogram these robots to become our personal slaves and take them back to the ship? I, I mean, I, I can I can try. It would be nice to have something like this, yes? Oh yeah, no, it would be. Do you think the Game Master will let us reprogram the robots <laughs> to become our personal slaves? I think the Game Master will let you take... Sorry. Will let you fully assemble two to act as guards on the ship. Okay. Of course, who outranks who with regards to the goblins and the guards is up to you guys. Mm-hmm. <laughs> are there any parts on the robots that we can salvage? I, I think the goblins aren't necessarily guards. They're they're more like pets. The uh, <laughs> the the Vesk were not restrained when they took care of them. The fact that you're able to piece two together. Actually, Mike, can you give me a computers or an engineering check. DC twenty two. Uh, okay. That'll give you the first one. If you get a 27, I'll give you the second one. Oh, serious system? business. Sure. Okay. We're going to try to give you a plus two on that roll, sir. If okay. That, if, if, if Jules wants to, Jules have engineering or computers? I, Lisi? I'm wow. looking. Uh, I succeed. She has engineering just... and computers. Okay, give her a check, too. She can give another plus two. Yes. I have computers, engineering. 
If Are you exceed a 10, you get her plus 2. My computer's is good. She got a 20 total. Okay. I succeeded on mine, so that's plus 4. I got a 21. That's plus 6. All right, so six. plus 6. All right. So the first one is... No, 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 no. It's, it's one roll. If you make oh, a 22, oh, you re revive 1. If you make a 27, you revive 2, but you get a plus 6 to the roll. Okay, so 17 plus 12 plus 6. I was got a plus 12, yeah. I forgot okay, so you're able, you're able to put two back together again to act as guards on the ship. You're not that impressed with them. It turns out they're, they're kind of old technology, but they do take a lick in and keep on taking a little perfect bit. perfect for the ship. I agree. <laughs> yep, okay. Oh, and, 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 and they make excellent, you know... Um, Waiters? I'm not gonna say waiters, but I can say they make uh, servants. I'm not gonna deck hands. They, 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 they're they're good at moving big things. Yeah. Oh, they're binary load lifters. Yes. It, actually, if you go to the bottom right of this page, you, you know, can see them. I know how to operate that, that load one. lifter over there. I have a class three rating. Oh, they're kind of cute, actually. <laughs> oh. So it turns out that was the you were supposed to fight one of those on the drift rock, and I chose that. That was the encounter I skipped where the robot fell apart. Thank you. Oh. Um, so it wouldn't, it, wouldn't, it wouldn't have been a challenge for you. That was sometimes I just skipped those, but it worked out well here because I wanted to introduce. I wanted to tie your. I wanted to cover two stories, That's so good. I had yours well, leading the his. And for what it's worth, uh, Ozzy, Ozzy was contracted with Natural Compounds Limited. He was working in a hot box, a jungle box around the sun, and they were um, disciples of the Church of Saren Ray. Saren Ray. That, that were Saren Ray. That he tried to uh, not slaughter and ended up getting slaughtered. They ended up getting slaughtered anyway. Hmm. So yeah, okay. and, all, oh, and and in all so that as he was telling the uh, the young uh, watch call that he had a contract that he ran out on and that's uh, not honorable either. How long ago was it? Uh, not well, a week ago, two weeks ago. Okay, okay. Oh, really recent. Like so. like I I ran from there and met up with you guys. As long as it took me to get from the sun to Absalom Station is how long ago it happened. All right. Got it. So also trigger. Yeah, so Ozzy's just been kind of hoping nothing. Yeah, go ahead. Nobody comes after him this whole time. I think Akita knows that we stole from his casino. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm pretty sure he's... Yeah. Is there anyone you guys have not stolen from or killed a family member of or pissed off in any way, shape, or form? Have you checked your pockets? I don't think uh, I have. I, where's my sword? I had my family's sword with me. Families. Oh, that was a sword? <laughs> Oh, I thought that was uh, just a nice piece of furniture. Oh, so <laughs> it's uh, oh, it might be under in my quarters. I I think I thought, saw it there. I will find it for you. You must have left it behind somewhere. You picked it up. Right? Yes, yes, I think I found it here. Oh, here, yes, here, <laughs> big sword. Yes, for this sword from... that will never come into play again. Because <laughs> <laughs> I All thought right. I might want a family heirloom, it turns out I don't. So so I, I have Chiska stuff ready, but I think we're better wait. Okay. Um, it actually ties into. His background, some. All right. And I have a little bit of her, maybe, sort of. She was sort of sending me a background at some point tonight that she's rewritten twice now. So. <laughs> so it's all so good. Gonna spend a resolve point to refresh my stamina, or should we just not bother? Didn't have to bother. Okay. You guys will get a rest before you go see Jiskus. Sounds good. So. Well, that was fun, Josh. I think Thank we will call much. it. I worked out pretty good. I'm happy with that. Got ourselves a spaceship. We tried a little space fighting. We're getting better at the space fighting. Yeah, we but it was spaceship fighting. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. We were fast as lasers. Yeah, that little that little cheat sheet was very helpful. Yeah, we need we need to spend a little more time on spaceship fighting. Well, the one yeah. way we can do that is, is have more, more spaceship, spaceship fights. Yeah, we're good. Hmm. Oh, I forgot to do sound effects tonight. Oh, yeah. We were in space. Oh, yeah. No, not no, you were Well, yes, when we were in space, we were. But space. when we weren't in space, we weren't in space. All right, guys, I'm going to turn off the recording for now. All right.